Hello and good morning. Welcome to the morning show. I'm Jenny Cleary and I'm going to be with you until one o'clock. So it's luscious to have your company today. I haven't seen you for a while. So please make sure you send us in a lovely text. 60777 is the text number. Uh, please start your message with the word JM Studio. Now I'm asking uh, what you've been up to. I'm asking if you've got any gossip whatsoever. We want to hear it. My gossip is this. Mike has had his nose pierced. It's caused a lot of controversy in, in this office because um, in the in studio... I'm not sure why he's done it. I'm looking at it from a motherly point of view. I'll um, bring him out for you later. Now, today, uh, we're going to have a bridal-themed show. Uh, so we are joined by a gorgeous lady. The lady, well, I'd like to call her the founder of Jewellery Maker. Her name is Sheila. Good oh, morning. Good morning, Jenny. How are you? Good morning, oh, good. everybody, as well. Hope you're all well and enjoying the sunshine. <laughs> I'm surprised you're here because you're so glamorous. I would have expected you to be at Ascot. Oh, darling, no. Darling, what's going no. on, darling? I've got something I could wear for Ascot, though, here. Uh, yes, you have. We have yes. got a, an Ascot headpiece. We have, yes. Uh, we're going to talk about that uh, a little bit later. But what have you got for everybody coming up that we have perhaps haven't seen before? Well, there's quite a few um, silver pieces, um, pendants, uh, quite a few pendants, pearls, of course, got to have the pearls. And um, just have another little look. Lovely yes. lace. Le lovely lace, yes. Lovely, different shaped pearls as well. So, really lovely, yeah. So, if you're into classic design with your jewellery making, if you love to create beautiful flowing pieces, then stay tuned because we've definitely got the items for you. And Sheila's definitely got the skills to help you uh, learn how to create those things. Um, I missed you. I'm not going to lie to you. It seems uh, ages, Jenny. I know. <laughs> I've been, uh, well, I was on last week. Oh, were you? Oh, right. I've been on off for a bit. So You've been off for a bit. I've been off for a bit. I've been here, there, and everywhere. Yeah, I have as well. Yeah, been here, there, and everywhere. Where have you been? Um, I've been to London twice. Oh. I went to see the Jersey Boys and went to a party in London. So, oh. yeah, it was brilliant. Yeah, been away for the weekend. The oh yes, well I had tea, of course. You know, yeah. Hi, they tea. were changing of the guards when I arrived. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Uh, now, what have you been up to, though? <laughs> what have you been up to? That's what I want to know. Let, let's show you some of the treats we've got for you today. Caramel opal is coming up for you today. This is Kimmy's pick of the day, and it's been really, really, really popular. Now, Fleur's next door. She's one of our guest designers. If you didn't know who she was, she's got quite a busy. Um, a busy workshop going on next door and she loves this she also loves the chain that i'm going to give to you uh, there they are there this, i meant to pop back in a minute ago but i it took me longer than expected to put my face on this morning <laughs> uh, now you've also got some beautiful black dye upside on a chain uh, we have got a uh, black spinel sorry you have got a whole wonderful strand of precious gemstones emeralds rubies sapphires amazing strand oh, wow. i've also got for you this one london blue topaz oh, i'd that say that's more swiss blue topaz in color oh isn't that stunning it's that amazing is just shouting out at me there i love topaz <coughs> it's absolutely beautiful it's Gorgeous. a bit of a treat to have topaz it is it? yes it is now and what what are you saying to me kim i can't hear me producer very me early bird yes you're very muffled kim a muffled brummy is what I can hear. It sounds like a little brummy in a box is what you sound like. But like, I've got, I'm brummy in a box. I quite like that. I would like a brummy in a box because you can always close the lid. Now, <laughs> I'm only joking. I love brummies. Now, have a look at this chain. Now, Fleur has been in here trying to get this, the little rascal. You're going to need to get on the phone line straight away. It's on sterling silver and it's nine karat gold on solid sterling silver. Really precious chain. Look at the quality that you've got. I love the links of this. And let me tell you, it feels heavy. It feels solid. It feels weighty. And that's what you want in a chain. You want that weight, don't you? Because when you put jewellery on and it feels lightweight, if you've paid a little bit extra and you know you're getting real gold and real silver, you want it to be weighty. You've got a whole metre. So you can make loads, or you could just use this as a very long chain to accommodate a gorgeous pendant that you've already made. Maybe you've got some precious um, metal wire that you've been using already, and you're looking for the chain to go with a pendant that you might have made. Maybe this is going to be for a bracelet. Maybe you're going to make several bracelets out of this. Anklet, hand jewelry. Anklet, hand jewelry. Yes, oh, the slave bracelets. The slave bracelets, yeah. And also around the hair, you know, the hairline for wedding... Um, 
bridal headwear. Yeah. I'm going to tell you a story. I've just got back from Marbella. Oh, where wow, ev all nice. of the girls, they're so gorgeous. They made me feel fat <laughs> and awful and old, of course. But watching them was amazing. These gorgeous girls with these chains that go across the yes. forehead and then over the top of the head uh, round to the back, which I'll show you in a sec. And um, they look beautiful. But it's festival season now because we've got Glastonbury coming up, yes, the Bee Festival yes. coming up, all of those festivals coming up. So if you're looking to create festival jewelry, this is perfect. So what the girls were doing in Marbella was around the head and then at the back there, hair down. They looked so gorgeous. I loved it. But you're right, a lot of the brides are doing that and the bridesmaids. They are, well. they it's are. so yeah. beautiful. I remember watching when I was younger, Never Ending Story, and then going into my mum's um, jewellery box and putting her necklaces on my head <laughs> so that I could be that princess. I, I, what was her name? I only remember a trail. I don't remember the princess's name. Someone text in, please. IYP, IYP. Sounds like I should say that like this, IYP, K30, is your rate them code? A whole metre. Loads of these I've got already. Gail and carefully has got two. Margaret's got two. Linda and Dorset's got two. Valerie and Surrey's got two. Uh, Dorset, yeah, Zena and Malaga. Oh my oh, gosh. Oh, so oh. jealous of that. They're all wearing them in Malaga. Oh. We're gonna give you a whole metre of sterling silver and nine carat gold chain for 14 pounds and 95 pence an incredible price tag for so much gold and silver now remember this is real nine carat gold overlaying real silver this is your early bird what are you going to make with yours seven grams let's see how long it is mind it is a meter but sometimes you don't really you don't really sort of appreciate how long a meter is do you i actually think i thought a meter was shorter than that look that's a that's a massive amount of chain, isn't it? And it's it's looking it looks quite small, but on when it's actually here, it looks bigger, doesn't it? You know what I mean? It, it's yes, it's it looks not a fine, thicker. Delicate, it isn't a fine. Chain. No, it's not. It's no. got some substance to it, it has, which is yes. going to be great yes. if you're using those bigger pendants. It's going to be wonderful if you want something that you know will be substantial. You know it's not going to break. Loads of you have got this. It does. I think this. I don't think it's going to last. Loads and loads of you are multiplying. Jenny and Bristol's got two. Uh, jewelry maker in Hampshire's got two. Nancy, Jill, jewelry maker in Tain and Weir. Gillian, you've got yours. A jewelry maker in Hertfordshire, where I'm from. Uh, Zena, you still haven't checked your basket out, my lover. Uh, jewelry maker in Gloucestershire. Oh, that's my Shire. Actually, that's actually where I'm from. The Shire. The Shire. They were talking about shires on the television the other day. How many shires there were? Oh, I love yeah. a shire. Yeah. Oh, I do love a shire. I like a shire too. Me too. I miss my. Shire. I'm in a shire too. Are you in Worcestershire? I'm in Warwickshire. Oh, lovely! It's lovely with the castle and everything. Oh yes, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. It's just it is. magic, really. But yeah, no, I think those those chains are. It's the first time I've seen that chain before, so I think they'll fly out today because. They're, they're so, um, they, you can use them in so many different ways. You can even cut them, I mean, I know it's, you know, you think, no, I won't cut them down, but you do sometimes mm -hmm. just to sort of put some gemstones in the middle so you can have a gemstone chain bracelet. Yeah, you can add little you links You can add little links to it. Don't be it. frightened. Exactly, that no, that exactly, that's exactly it. You get to be a jeweler, really, when you're toying about yeah, those sorts yeah. of things, don't you? Let's put it at the bottom of the screen, Kim. Bottom of the screen. Now, I'm going to give you, no, uh, Kim, Sorry, my love, you're still a brummy in a box. Did you say those are brand new colours? They've never been on the morning show before. Now, this one's my favourite because it's the green and the navy blue. It's absolutely luscious. It reminds me of peacocks. Well, you know I am obsessed with peacocks. I was trying to find the right peacock painting to go in my bathroom at the moment. That's what's happening. I've turned boring, haven't I? Have a look. Our Jackie in Somerset say, Morning everyone, the three colours of cord. You have on display. Can you tell me what time they will be on the show? I have to go out, unfortunately. Thanks, Jackie. Jackie, they're on there, love. Don't you be going nowhere. Have an extra cup of tea. Yeah, Jackie, have a cup of tea. I love the green and the blue together. I love that. That's my favourite one. I love it. Then I think the next cord is gonna go in your Christmas collection. And if you're watching for the first time today and you're thinking, don't even think about saying Christmas. Ah, well, let me tell you, people who make jewellery, make clothes, make anything like that, they have to think really far in advance. And in fact, they're working on their Christmas collections already because if they're not, they're not ready for the rush. They could miss those essential 
those essential designs that they need to give to their customers. So now is the time. And of course, when you see Christmas colours, get them because then you're prepared. Nothing worse than thinking, oh, I'll get that later. It's not available. You can't make the piece. How many times does that happen when you actually want something and you think, no, I'll leave it. I'll, I'll maybe, you know, give it next time. week and it's gone. It annoys me um, so much. Yeah. Or I'll go, oh, I won't get that because yeah. I shouldn't really. Yes. And then I get home and I can't stop thinking about it. Yeah. And then, do you do that as well? Why, because I, rack, I think once you're a parent, you feel guilty for buying things Yes, you do. So yeah. you think, oh, I won't get that because they'll probably want something. If you keep thinking about it, says Claire, my director, you should just get it. Exactly. It's true because otherwise you're just, your brain's never got... You're, you're never at peace. <laughs> you're never at peace. You're you never can't at peace. Sleep for it. No. <laughs> I can't sleep anyway. Now look at this. You've got the red and the green. Perfect for Christmas. I like the little um, sort of Soutache esque designs that are being done with this. So if you're not really brilliant at Soutache, you can do a cheat and use some jewelry yes, glue. You can. And this, it looks yes. wonderful. Yeah. Then I'm going to give to you the red. Oh, that's the classic red. Now, this isn't just for Christmas. Red's for Valentine's Day. It's for prom it's season. For, it's for summer holiday. Where, Definitely. You know, the, rich, the richness of it. It's. I think it's an all year, all of them are all year round colours. I think red's quite a, an important colour. I think that a lot of people can wear it and it's so strong and it makes a statement, doesn't it, mm -hmm. red? We think about Marilyn Monroe and we think about that incredible um, lipstick campaign. Uh, and all of that lot, you, you, you know, red is a strong colour for the for, for occasions like that. And it Valentine's mixes Day. so well with most other colours as yeah, well. Yeah, oh, most definitely. And, and I think with those, because they have that sort of sparkle to them, they're great with crochet, knitting, uh, bobbin work. You can, you can use them in any of your textile designs. So they are absolutely gorgeous. They're beautiful, aren't they? Uh, NQRK14 is your item code. You've got 110 metres in each. Is that in each? No, 40 metres in each, my, I'm sorry. Uh, and we've got a text about my favourite time of the year, it's Christmas, well, well Christmas and summer. Uh, Sharon in Essex, shut up. Uh, morning, I've already started making Christmas decorations, beaded reindeers, yes, using smoky cords. Oh, Sharon, I'm coming round, I don't live far from you. I'm coming round, we'll make reindeers together. I love that idea. Right, all three Zari th threads, not Fred. 110 metres in totales. A 30-day, no questions asked, money-back guarantee, six ninety-five for your soutache designs, for your macrame or macrame if you're shopping from the US of A, uh, for your kumahima, it looks amazing with this, doesn't it? You're doing a beaded kumahima. Let me show you, actually, a fat braid that I've got next to me. Go for a little walk. This is on, on the flat kumahimo disc. You get, like, the square. But you can do something like this. You can make friendship bracelets. Hey, it's the summertime. Friendship bracelets are always popular in the summertime, especially if maybe um, the kids are going from junior school up to senior school. They want to give their friends some friendship bracelets. Six ninety-five. What a brilliant price tag. Loads of you on the phone lines. Oh, eight hundred six triple four six double five. All the W's dot jewelrymaker dot com. If you are shopping online, you can also shop on our app, and you can watch us on our app as well. If you're on the computer right now. Uh, you can just click watch us now. You won't know this actually if you're not watching us already, will you? You'll already know if you're watching us already. Otherwise, it's, there's no oak. You won't be able to hear me. Six pounds and ninety-five pence. It's just lovely to have your company today here on Jerry Maker. Make sure you text us. I've missed you. I haven't seen you for a week. And what have I been up to? What what things have I done? I haven't done anything tragic this week. <laughs> I hope not. Which makes me feel a bit on edge. Tragic. Uh, here's the way to text that. Are you disappointed in me? I did get caught. I did get stuck and sucked in in Singapore two weeks ago in one of those um, massage chairs. Oh. I sat on one and it clamped onto me and it really hurt and I couldn't get out. <laughs> it wasn't relaxing Could at all. Could only happen to you. <laughs> well, what <laughs> happened was I had a nine-hour stopover. The stupid oh, man who booked my flight, who I work for, it was stopped over at midnight, so I couldn't go anywhere. So I thought, uh, in Singapore, it was the best airport I've ever been to in my life. A big row of massage chairs, and you just sit in them for free, right? So I'll have a lie in that. And they lie down, right? So I was led down. Here I am, on my own, got no one to talk to. So when I make a fool of myself, it's just me. Just you. <laughs> just me, on my own, there's no one to go, like, laugh with. Massive family right by me, all asleep in theirs. Started going, I was like, oh! Uh, it hurt and I like a massage 
this felt like it was trying to stab me in the legs. So I thought, I've got to get out. I'm pressing all these buttons, but they're all in... What language do they speak in Singapore? <laughs> Chi I don't know. Chinese? It's Sing Singaporean. Sing Sing Singaporean. Sing Singaporean. It, like, it was like Chinese writing, though. Anyway, I couldn't understand it, whatever it was. And I pressed the whatever button I did, and it clamped me in. I couldn't <laughs> get out. I literally had to remove myself, take my shoes off, slip my foot out. It was horrible. It was an experience I never want to experience again. And everyone was just looking at me. It's always bad <laughs> when no one laughs, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. You had any embarrassing experiences at airports? Do text us in. 6 0 trap or 7. Trap or? Trap or 7. 6 0 trap or 7. Uh, James Studio followed by your message. Uh, now, I'm going to give to you. To my left, oh, all these luscious strands. I love these colours. Do you look at this? Oh, I've got to say a big hello to all the girls at Want That Trend. Go and uh, go and have a look at my uh, presenter page today. Now, have a look at this. I love oh, colour. Oh wow! Isn't this lovely. <gasps> what lovely, 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 lovely colours. They are gorgeous, aren't they? They are gorgeous. Don't they all go so well? They're, they're, yeah, they're your sort of, um, they're cream and biscuit and beige. They're very neutral colours, aren't they? Which will go with anything and everything that you wear. And the, I love the these two together. Gorgeous. And this is why I was just saying about um, the girls that want that trend, because it's um, Lady I Know that designs dresses. And I am just in love with them all. The colours are amazing. And I'm into wearing colour at the moment. I'm into wearing all these lovely colourful dresses. It's summertime. Let's, let's celebrate that with some colour. Look at the designs. Go on the websites at the moment. Look at all of the different clothes designers that you can go and visit. Go and have a look what's going on on the websites and online. And see how all of this colour, put, when it's put together, it just looks amazing. Look at these two together. They're luscious. Now, what I'm showing you here together is the Amazonite, and you've got two strands of that. I love that green. That is lovely, isn't it? And the blue chalcedony. Now, traditionally at Jewelry Maker, do you remember when we used to have blue chalcedony? It was very expensive. I think the price has come down on blue chalcedony at the moment, so now I think it's the time to buy it. You've got two gorgeous strands, and just, do you know what? It's just such a cool breeze collection, these two together. And then let's add a little bit of the peachy and sandy tones and that's just a desert a, a desert island isn't it not a desert island which would be well, which would be just as nice i'm there at desert island are you i used to actually think that was a place when i was little did you when you used to read i go into a desert island now these uh, do you know what that reminds me of a, a waterfall very flowing colors together aren't they very fluid and very calming and then i'm going to give to you dendrite opal look at those blues i love this it's like a happy memory strand bundle isn't it do you ever th think, and I think this is like some psychological thing, when you look back into your memories when you were a child, it was a sunny yeah, day. If you're looking back on a fond yeah. memory, of course. Uh, and it's these kinds of colours I love. We, we need more happy memories and sunny days, don't we? And then look at this moonstone. Absolutely gorgeous. I love the sound of moonstone. I think it sounds very romantic. You can almost hear the water, can't you, with the pebbles and the you can almost yeah. hear it can't yeah you? you can absolutely gorgeous that is i've taken to listening to spa music as i fall asleep <laughs> but it always makes me need a wee halfway through the night <laughs> have a look at this green amethyst now the green amethyst is a very very subtle green a hint of green a dewdrop green just here on the end very very delicate green and then I'm going to give to you some clear quartz isn't there a lot in this bundle let me count one two three four Hang on. some of them look as though they've got three strands in there I've got two of some of them three ah. four, on, one two three four five six seven eight 
nine. Oh, is this nine strands or ten? But then if ten you double strands. up, because they're double, aren't they? They're not just because of the side. If you hold one up, they're double. The they're size double, of so they're twenty, strands. twenty yeah. strands, aren't they? And, and do you know what? Sometimes people come. Oh well, it's not a double strand. That's how it comes. Well, actually, it is double. It is the, double the. It's yeah. double the average strand size or length even. Um, and actually, so then people say, but they're small, but they're not in comparison to some other gemstones. Uh, so they are essentially, I think, a double strand, whether you like it or not. Ten whole strands. This is a great way to introduce yourself. Now, these are all genuine gemstones. That's what we're passionate about here at Jewelry Maker. I'm not talking to you about glass or plastic. I'm not talking to you about something that looks like quartz, that looks like green amethyst. I'm not telling you about something that looks like moonstone. This is the real deal. You can sew this into clothing. You can use it for your haberdashery. You can use it for your homewares. You can use it to make gorgeous jewelry. We're gonna give you the findings and everything you need. You can find so much on our website. Why don't you give it a go? Make the jewelry to go with the perfect outfit. Two pounds a strand at 20 pounds. These are genuine gemstones. They are not faux gemstones. This is such a great price tag. Angelique of the East Ridings of Yorkshire. You sound frightfully posh, darling. Wow, 10 strands for 20 pounds. How great. You've done it again, jewelry maker. Hi, girls. Lovely to see you both. Ange Thank you, Angelique. Mwah. I love your name. I might steal it. Yeah. <laughs> it's cool. I'd love it if someone asked me what my name was and the answer was Angelique. Angelique. Wouldn't you? Mm. I'd love that to be the answer. We have an Angeline here, don't we? Angeline, Angeline, but not Angelina. Angelina, Angelina. Yeah, that's right. Angeline. Yeah. yeah. Angelina or Angelina? It sounds uh, angelic, isn't it? You know, pure. It's Angeline, and, yeah. Yeah. It, it confu I confused myself here. Good, brilliant way to uh, build a stash up. Now, we're going to saunter over. Going to sort my life out. And uh, I'm going to show you Sheila's challenge today, which is also going to double up as a clearance deal, which is fantastic because you're going to get, I think, a gemstone that is going to stretch all the way through the seasons. I don't think this is just uh, an autumnal gemstone. When you see the colour, you think, oh, great for autumn. But actually, no. Think about those tribal pieces. Think about sand. Oh, do you know what it reminds me of? I not the new one because I haven't seen that yet, but Mad Max. Have you seen it? Have, have yeah. you seen the old one with Tina Turner in it? No, I haven't. No. What do you mean you haven't seen that? No, I haven't. Get and watch it tonight. It reminds okay. me of that. Really? Yeah. All I mean, I, I, Mel Gibson. I, yeah, I just look at that, and I, uh, when I saw it this morning, I said to Claire, I said, oh, I said, you know, I wouldn't do much with it. I mean, I will, but it just looks lovely like that with the, with the two strands. So you mean you don't want to toy too much with the design, but have a look, because these trapezoids mm. make brilliant fans. They slot together perfectly, but you're right. Yeah. They, and you know what? And they may need three three or four. Around. I've made a round Oh, that's them. amazing. Yeah. Can we show everybody? Yeah, oh, that's wonderful. How did you do that? And they, they just slot together so, so easily. Was it with wire? Yeah, just a little bit of gold wire. It's oh, really there good. There you go. And it looks solid as well. And it is, yeah. Oh, I love that. So and that's, that's very summery, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, you could, you could make quite a few of those. In fact, I may, do, I may make another one either side of that. I really so like I've that. got quite a feature piece. But, yeah, they, they are, they, they, they're ones that we don't really think about too much. But it's made me think today. And it's made me realise how well they sit together. They do. And they really do sit well together. So... I think they're a, I think they're a must today. I like them doubled up like that. Actually, I do think they're going to make a really pretty choker. Yeah, and even and even with a little tiny little bit of this, Jenny, couldn't you know when you do the coiling with your wire? Just mm -hmm. even if you wanted to just do a little bit in between each one, or put one of your big gold spacer beads in between, mm -hmm. they just look stunning because they are so. They are so holiday, aren't they? I, they are. See, when I first saw these, I thought autumn they're going to look great yeah. with the jasper, the rich burnt umbers, and they will. But actually, now for me, they're very summery. I'm thinking they're maxi summery. dress. I'm yeah, thinking uh, flip flops or bare feet on the sand or with a bikini on and a really. Do you know? I couldn't believe when I went on holiday. I'm going to keep saying this. Full in makeup the, the girls were in. All this jewelry. I know. And I know and all these amazing bodies and bikinis and heels on the beach. And I know. <laughs> On the beach. Just like what what happened do? to slough it up? With I know we look with your flip flops. And I like no it. make. Yeah. It's all glamour. I love it. But then when you get sand in your flip flops, it's not fun, is it? No, but they do. Or your have heels. Flip -flops on. They really well, have. Yeah, but even heels, you'd, you'd get stuck in the sand, mm. wouldn't you? So, but anyway. Mm. Oh, I love it. But I, I this. really do love the shape of these. 
They really slot together beautifully. They They're going to work very well individually as well as pendants. You could They'd do They'd be really nice actually prong set one of these into a ring, wouldn't they? Loads of you on the phone lines. This is going to be a clearance deal. NEGC58 is your item code. Loads of you there. Because, because they're because they're top drill, Jenny, you could do half moons all the way round. I might do some half moons there. Yeah, and you could go one way, could go one, one way, way one way down like a wave effect chair. Yeah. I love it. Now mm. I've got to tell you uh, that these are eight pounds and ninety five pence. Loads of you have grabbed this deal already. Uh, the diameter of these twelve by eight millimeters and eight ninety five for two strands is crazy. It's insane. Brilliant value. Now, don't forget, this is real picture jasper. It's going to look great with the traditional jaspers, those sort of mm. burnt orange colours. Oh, yes. Look wonderful with that. Yes. And, and it looks great with mukite as well. It's got some similar properties to mukite, mm. hasn't it? Mm. These Definitely are gorgeous. Has. But, and I mean, smoky quartz, your, your black onyx, you know, some, some of the real rich, the reds that we, you know, that we were talking about earlier on would go lovely with that. The oranges. Gold. It, would, it would, absolutely. Yeah. Totally agree. Pearls. Oh, for everything oh, for I love pearls. For, yeah, for I'm the evening. I'm so into yeah. them. Mm. Sorry, I stabbed you. Them That's with my all nails. right. Um, uh, NEG C fifty eight is your right code. Now we're going to leave that one with you. Loads of you on the phone lines. I've just got to warn you that there are queues on the phone lines for this one at the moment. Uh, so you have got if you have got this into a basket, please check it out as soon as you can. Right now, it's time for our first spotlight deal. <laughs> I think the first gemstone shape that we all use and get and identify ourselves with is a round. We like to make bracelets out of rounds and I think then we up our game a little bit. We go to something a little bit posher so we might start with a quartz that's in round uh, and then we, we sort of start going up and up. We'll go to a beautiful round pearl. Well, I've got something that's going to sit so well. If you've got any perfect round white pearls, I've got the most amazing strand of rounded tanzanite check these out eight millimeter rounds and they are absolutely gorgeous i've got some rough cut ruby now remember this is real tanzanite if you're wondering what's tanzanite if you're if you're tuning oh isn't that lovely with ruby tanzanite is a gemstone that is only found in one place in the world it's found at the foothill of mount kilimanjaro it's said to be a thousand times rarer than a diamond. Launched by Tiffany & Co. It's really exclusive. You'll see it in the big, thick, glossy magazines. You'll see it worn by the celebrities. It's probably the most exclusive gemstone there is. Now, when I went into Tiffany & Co. recently, it was um, at the aforementioned Singapore airport, actually. Uh, and I asked them about um, what grade their tanzanite was, and they told me they don't have graded tanzanite. They don't do graded tanzanite. It's not something that um, they have in stock in that particular store. I can vouch for that. Now, I want you to see, of course, this, I'm not giving you a graded tanzanite here, but I am giving you a tanzanite that's very rich in blue. Now, the richer the blue, traditionally, I think, the more, it, the more money you're expected to shell out for it. So the paler the tanzanite, the better price it tends to be. The richer, the deeper it is, the more expensive it tends to be. You're seeing some really rich tanzanite here. In these rounds, you've got a, a major up, I think, a, a major advantage because you can create things that are very traditional. You can create the traditional beaded bracelet. You can create the traditional simple drop earrings with these very simply. And I think the key thing with this kind of a gemstone is to keep it simple. I, I would definitely think about using these in bridal pieces in your tiaras, in your fascinators, absolutely. I would definitely think about using these in conjunction with your chainmail. One either end of a chainmail bracelet, one in the center of a chainmail necklace. I think these are just stunning. I think if you want to create jewelry that you're going to get valued, this is a strand that I would absolutely recommend that you get in your collection. Let's have a look. I've got the most amazing pearls here. Let's have a look next to pearls. Together with real fresh water, out of the oyster pearls, they just sing and dance, don't they? Oh, they're lush, they are. I love that. Absolutely perfect. 
and we are going to a spotlight deal price tag for you. Be on the phone. So there's a queues are still there a bit from the Jasper deal that we did. We're really busy today. It's Lush to have your company, by the way. ROG P63. No, it was only actually 49.95 to begin with. I was expecting it to be more in the 60 mark. I've done um, sapphires for 70 pounds in this size, and isn't Tanzanite more expensive than a sapphire traditionally? It is, isn't it? We're going to give you a spotlight deal. Can I spit me words out? Spotlight deal price tag today, though. It's not 49.95 today. We're going to give you an even better price tag. We're going to go down to £39.95. We shouldn't spl uh, slash prices on Tanzanite. It's true, but we are. ROG P63. You are getting a 30-day money-back guarantee. Make sure you're checking out baskets. Loads of you stacking up there already. I have got a jewellery maker in Surrey. I've got a jewellery maker in Greater London. Turn. I've got a uh, jewellery maker in the Wirral. I've got a jewellery maker in Tyne and Ware, West Midlands. Loads of you there. ROG P63. Kent, the Shire. Another jewellery maker. Amanda from Great, uh, Greater London. Where are you from, Mikey? What shire are you from? Warwickshire. Mikey here. Um, could you come out with your nose piercing, please? Right, this is my argument. Mikey's not a young lad. Are you 30 yet, Mikey? Uh, 31. 31. Uh, he decided last week Hello. that he wanted to have... Now, I'm worried about Mikey because his weight's dropping. <laughs> Are you, are you uncomfortable uh, with me touching you? Shall no, we coiling a bit? I just was thinking I'm not, don't think I'm that. I like that you're dressed like that. Okay. I like it, yeah, I like it too. I like oh, Mikey too. Yeah, Mikey's looking good, but I want you to just see what Mikey's done. I say it's on the wrong side. No, no one's there to cut the shot in there, because I'm not in there. Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> oh, yeah, Claire's there. Oh, she is, okay. Right. So um, I want you to look at Mikey's nose. He's had it pierced. I like it, but I'm saying he needs more tattoos, tattoos now, oh, no. tattoo, if he's going to get away with this, okay. I'm bad, look, I've got my nose picked. What's your mum saying? She's not going to like it, she hasn't actually she seen it. She hasn't seen it. it. No. So. Because if you were my son, I'd be quite cross with you. I felt a bit cross with you this morning, didn't mm. I? You're a little, yeah, slightly irritated about it. But that. then when you explained to me why you had it done, I was like, all right then. You've been, you, you toyed with it, you prepared by putting a magnetic one on, people liked it, you liked it, and you thought you're going to go for it because you only live once. Mm -hmm. So I, I accept that. Okay. I'm saying more tattoos. What are you saying, jury makers? What are you, are you going to have another tattoo? I, I am, yeah, I'm planning to. Um, I'll, I'll talk to you about that later. Okay, he's I'll off. Explain later. Doesn't like being a liar. You say not more tattoos. I'm not. I haven't got a tattoo, only because I'm a wimp. I went out in Ibiza once, my friend fell asleep. I think discreetly then, you know, though, but not all over me, personally. I like David Beckham's tattoos, though. Do you? Do you not? Who could not well, like, I like David They're Beckham, amazing. yeah. I like David Beckham, but... His, his tattoos are lush, aren't they? I don't suppose you notice the tattoos, really, with David Beckham. I do, too. the whole package. Yeah. Mm. The whole package. He's so good-looking. He is. He is so good-looking. He is. Posh really landed on her feet, didn't, didn't she? Didn't she just? Do you remember when she first started the Spice Girls and she was Victoria Adams? What was it? Adams something. It was a double barreled one because she was engaged to someone. Was she? Who was it? What was it? Victoria Adams I something. I didn't know that. I can't remember. She was engaged to someone. Wow. Cool. Can think of how it could have gone. Posh. <laughs> think of how it could have gone. You've only got to look at Malby. Now, have a look. <laughs> That was a joke. They're all doing really well. It was a joke. Melby does watch a lot. This kit is lush. Do you know why it's lush, Kim? Do you remember when we launched um, a similar strand to this back in the day? <gasps> They're back! Oh, I love them. They're this gorgeous, is aren't they? the best strand for me. It's not the most expensive strand. It's not. It's the best one, though. Do you think that, Kim, is the best strand in jewellery maker that we've ever had, this one? I oh, think love it's these. perfect for weddings, isn't it? Perfect for children's, or even, you know, it, you can have the bride with it in, in her headpiece, you know, the little bridesmaids. Yeah, love it. I love it. I mm. actually think it's great in anklets, mm. just white. Yes. Brilliant for charm yeah. bracelets. I love this strand. It's a really long <laughs> strand as well. It's, it's quite a fairy tale, isn't it? 
Oh, I love like, it. What well, do I actually yeah. think it could be anything? Could go for men. Could go it in could. earrings. It, it could. could. It could. It could. Yes. I think um, it could go if you were making a collage. I think it would go yeah. pressed into your resins and your polymer clays. Absolutely. Perhaps. And I'm gonna. This is probably quite a big statement to make about any gemstone here in Jamaica. Perhaps the most versatile strand we've ever had is this one because it fits in so many different themes. I, d I don't think it's gender specific either. I think anyone can wear this. I love it. They can be rings. They're the right size. They can be rings. They can be charms. They can be anything you want them to be. And look at that luster. It's undeniably lush, that luster, isn't it? I love it. And I'm just trying to look for these. Now, these are hematites. We don't have a lot of hematites, unless things have changed since no, I've we stopped don't. working no, as we, much. We, no. We have, but when it comes in, it goes out really quick. I love that. And this is going to go very well with chainmail. There's kind of a medieval feel to that Yeah, colour. there is. Yeah, there is. Definitely. I love it. I'm, I'm all into like the moon and the stars. I'm a massive fan of Natalia, who used to be our guest designer here and all of our angel cards and stuff like that. So I love yes. it. I love anything yes. like this. Um, you know, I'm a bit of a weirdo like no, that. No, you're not at all. I, 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 I love that too. I, I sometimes, I, in fact, I bought cards with little stars on in the past. Did you? Mm. Yeah. Have a look. Now, am I getting this pendant or is that just, oh, I am getting it. I thought it just appeared out of nowhere and I was like, where's he come from? Now, have you got a gorgeous oval of in your stash? Uh, or any gemstone, actually. Anything. I love that. You've only got one left. What are you going to do with it? Are you good at resin work? Do you love to do polymer clay? I actually think I would use this pendant without a gemstone inside it. Do you know that? Sterling silver. It's lush. Look at that. White topaz and solid sterling silver. Now, this, these have got prongs in them, so you can set your own gemstone, but you don't have to. It doesn't have to be a gemstone either. It could be resin or anything. I'd like to see more resin here at Jewelry Maker. I want you to see these pearls. They're genuine, out of the oyster pearls. You've got two strands of them. They're absolutely lush. Have a look at them. They're so round. These are yummy, yummy, yummy. Aren't they lush? They're perfect, like Ryland's teeth. Aren't they like Ryland's teeth? I love his teeth. In fact, I quite fancy him, even though I know he's not for the girls. Look. Do you fancy Ryland? Or is it just me? But he's so good looking. He's so handsome. He's such a beautiful... Rylan. She's like, who? Do you fancy Rylan, Sheila? No. No, she no. doesn't. Sorry. No. You don't have to be sorry. There's more Rylan for me if you don't fancy him. No, no. Who does it for you? Me? Mm. Gosh. Um, well, they're probably... Mm, Buble? Going back a bit. Who? Buble? Um, yeah, I like, I like him. I like yeah. him to, to sort of listen to him singing. Yeah. Or I'll have to think about that because there's quite a few. I want to know who's on your top poster list please oh. so I can print you one off and you can put it up can I can I come back in five minutes when I when I work out Absolutely. the real I'll one come that back I to you in really five minutes. okay okay beautiful freshwater pearls these are the birth gemstone of June we know how glamorous pearls are we know that oh do you know Kate did you, anyone see Kate Middleton at the polo with little baby George they all went to uh, Gloucestershire for the polo and the you know what pearls make me think of her I love the fact that they're so classic and so classy. And Zara Phillips usually wears a little pair of pearl studs as well. She was there with her little daughter, Mia. I like to think she stole that name from me. It's absolutely beautiful. Then look, I've got coral for you. Stunning drops of coral. These are drill hold kind of through the middle. They're going to make beautiful flowers. And talking about flowers, I know what you can see. Now these are wonderful uh, if you want to incorporate these into dresses or into your soft furnishings, but they look amazing in the hair. They look wonderful as pendants. They're gorgeous as the centerpiece on a choker. They're wonderful for soutache. Now, if you have a look, these have a half drill hole. So in fact, you can make stud earrings out of these. 
they'd be lovely, wouldn't they? I want to bring back the Dallas trend, don't you think? And the and the uh, Dynasty trend. I want With to look like Crystal Carrington. <laughs> Why? Where's our glamour gone? Yeah. We're not glamorous enough these days. I loved that when women were in business. It's like women were in business for the first time. So we really went for it, didn't we? we with did. the whole style. And I love it. Now, you're also getting what Fleur, guest designer next door, said was some of the nicest clear quartz she'd seen in a long time because of the shape. A very different shape to what we're used to. Have a look. And don't forget you had those Hemus Height stars. And don't forget you had two strands of coral. And don't forget the silver pendant with the topaz in sterling silver. Don't forget one, two, three, four. Hand carved shell flowers. These are gorgeous and carved from real shell. A QG C94, the perfect bouquet I think there's boutique five. collection the flowers there's five of the flowers oh there's five i'm yeah, sorry there's five yeah five flowers i only had four mateo's probably a half inched one <laughs> oh eight hundred six triple four six double five should be 84 pounds but today we're going to give you an incredible price like of just 54 pounds and 95 pence you've got everything you need to start jewelry making with you can get findings and all the rest of it in your wire from our website. We perhaps might be giving you some a little bit later. Please don't forget that you get a 30 day money back guarantee and a bottomless basket with us here at Jewelry Maker. Everything you put in your basket, hey, the price is going down. That little brummy in a box is being naughty. £49.95. pence, Under £50 pounds for all of this. Absolutely super deal. Kim, your, um, your catchphrase, your little, um, what, not a catchphrase. What's the tune called when you've got your own tune to go with you? Your theme tune, that's it, is in the, is in the tune of Baby Monkey Backwards on a Pig. But it's, brought me in a box. Don't know the rest of it. <laughs> yeah. Kim Producer, Kim Producer. Brought me in a box, Kim Producer. This world has gone insane. Uh, 49.95. Well, everybody was obsessed with that, weren't they, Baby Monkey? I bet you'll all have it in your head now. Baby Monkey, riding on a pig. Now, let's go over to that gorgeous Lady Sheila. I'm going to take my cup of tea that oh, Amelia's made me. It's a nice cup of tea, Amelia. Let's have a little bit. I'll, I'll be the judge of that. Mm. As far as Amelia's tea goes... It's a good cup of tea. It's not bad. It's a good cup of tea. Well, she has given me before herbal tea with milk in it and um, tea that, with the remnants of a cup of soup in it. So oh, as far as that nice. goes, at least it's clean. Now, <laughs> oh, I love these earrings. Aren't they gorgeous? Let's have... No, we're not going to do a demo on this one, I'm just hearing. Okay. Were you aware of that already? Yeah. Um, because we just don't have time today because Kim's just being tight with time. Look at this. Oh, I love this. Look what Sheila's done with the pendant. That is gorgeous. It's just beautiful, isn't it, that pendant? Mm -hmm. It really, really is. How do you think working with it? it. I, lo I loved it. I mean, it's absolutely gorgeous and it's got such sparkle on it as well. I love... And to get all of those into the, the collection, you know, and all the, yeah, it's, it was just amazing. I loved it. Loved Using it. a little bit of wire and your imagination, you can create beautiful fascinators to go. I mean, it's Ascot this week. It is, We have yes. Cheltenham races. We have all sorts of occasions where we dress up. I love the races. And I mean, it, it is, I mean, brides now, you know, they, they do have to plan a couple of years in advance, don't they, with mm -hmm. their venues and everything. So I think to actually buy the, buy your, your sort of um, pearls and your quartz and, whatever it is you want for your wedding, it's the time to buy now. Definitely. And it's and so this much a very cheap piece as well, isn't yes. it? Yeah, you can make so much out to one collection. It's a beautiful boutique collection at just £49.95. pence. You can use your debit cards or your credit cards, and you can also pay by PayPal on the app. Thank you so much, Sheila. I've got to go back to my desk now. Gorgeous, gorgeous collection for you. Don't forget those handcuff flowers. Can I just show you where Sheila's used those as well? The lash right in the center here oh not it just i love that it reminds me of alice in wonderland yeah it does a bit the white yes, roses and the red bit. roses isn't that yeah. lovely i love big fat roses mm. 
Yeah, I've got some in the garden. Have, they're just oh, hanging down. Yeah, how lovely. gorgeous. When and they just come out, they're, they're really I know, fat. And you're thinking steak, you oh, might I want to spray them. them to keep them like that. Yeah, you? I know. Why won't they stay like yeah. that? I've got orchids growing in my garden. I think, I think it's a Japanese mm. orchid. Amazing, oh, like climbing up my wall and all, all of these. The guy mm. who was there before me put, put, them, put them in. in. Oh, yeah. yeah. Now, I've got to go back over, but thank you. Okay. I'll be back thank to you. you in a sec, my lovely. Uh, and we're going to go back on over because I have got for you in number six. Oh, number ten, that didn't say nothing like number six. Oh, I'm definitely having these, Kim. Now, I've seen these before, Kimmy, and I love them. I'm just going to grab my... Um, now, a great way to use the hematite stars from this kit is together with these and they are solid sterling silver star stud earring findings now they come with the um, with the backs as well of course and we've got a little loop on the end you can snip that off if you just want a plain stud I love those I might get Sheila to make me some stars with stars what do you think do you think they'd look cute just with another star dangling. I love that idea. Aren't these gorgeous? Now, they're sterling silver and you have got six pairs. One pair, let's think about how much one pair would be in your high street. About 20 pounds for a pair of solid sterling, uh, how much was Mike's one stud in his nose? Can we find that out? We'll ask him in a bit. How much do you think studs are on the high street? I'm going to say up to £20 for a pair of silver, sterling silver studs with no gemstones. Have a look on a high street jeweller's website, Kim Boy, my little uh, brummy in a box. How are you, Amelia? Are you all right? She's all right. You're not massively all right, though, are you? She's all right. She's not, like, excited about anything today. Oh, you are? Oh, OK, good. Have a look. How they look in the ears. I'm not a big fan of looking at my own ears in the mirror, I'm not going to lie to you. The cheapest you can find, actually I think this is really cheap. Uh, Kim says $7.99 for one pair on the, on the website on, in a high street jewellers that's not famed for being expensive if that makes any sense. Beginning with, not H, Kim, H, darling. <laughs> so, okay, what's that? Seven pounds is seven ninety-nine, did you say? Seven nine, okay, so what's that times six? Forty-seven ninety-four, okay. We're not charging forty-seven ninety-four, though, are we? UDG C nineteen is your item code. No, we're not. Fourteen pounds and ninety-five pence for six pairs of gorgeous earrings. They're solid sterling silver. Are they marked? Let's have a little look. Yeah, they got the nine two five on the stud part, on the post part. Fourteen pounds and ninety-five pence incredible incredible value and don't forget you'll be offering your customers genuine sterling silver you can make drop earrings you can do this with our gems of distinction you can use uh, just like the hematite stars that i showed you earlier there's so much you can do just one tiny droplet and you i definitely think you'll make your money back and more i think these are going to be very profitable for you if you're selling your jewelry now i'm going to give to you Which Labradorite? The, this one. A brand new strand of Labradorite. This is lush and it's got red in it. Have a little look. Have a little butchers at this. I love it. Let me find that red I just saw. Can you see it? Let me do, hang on, I'll tell you what's occurring is that I've got that behind it. So you see. Look at the colours that you get from this strand. It's a remarkable strand. I love that powerful labradorescence. Now labradorite is a gemstone that gives you this incredible oil on water effect totally naturally. 
That is not an enhancement of the gemstone. It comes out of the ground looking like that. Now, no one's ever proved that this story isn't true. I heard that, that, that a piece of land in Canada was enchanted and um, some powerful sorcerer trapped fairies inside the rocks. And that is what Labradorite is. Now, no one's ever proved that that's not the truth. I don't think. I'm not saying they've proved it's the truth either. I'm just saying it's my theory. I think something amazing has occurred. Look. Look at all of that colour. Isn't it lush? Is it your favourite favourite? It is uh, the jewellery maker's favourite in the last three consecutive years. Three or four consecutive years. How many years have we been in this game? What shape are we calling these? They're faceted ovals, apparently. I think I would make rings out of these. Look at that. Oh, I love that. It's beautiful, isn't it? I would um, make earrings out of uh, the smaller ones as well because I graduated. I love the little ones. Sometimes the little ones are the most powerful, aren't they? Isn't that lovely? Don't you think that's lush? Remember that you always get that 30 day money back guarantee. If you're looking at this now thinking, oh, I don't. Maybe you've never used Labradorite before. Just please just get it because it's the best. Everyone, everyone votes for this for a reason, don't they? Should be seven pounds and ninety five pence, but it's what do you mean? Hang on. Six ninety five. Are you mad? She probably is, actually, yeah. About Philip. Six ninety five Y T C one, two, three is your item code. You are mad about the boy. Um, Kim, do you ever call him Philip or Pip? Don't call him Pip, apparently. He hates Philip. He just likes being called Phil. Oh, Kim and Phil. Or Kill, as they're commonly known here in the office. Oh, your baby's going to be so cute. Fimbley. <laughs> Six pounds and 95 pence. Lindsay, you've got yours. Dawn, you've got yours. Anne and Valerie and Catherine and Patricia. Jury maker in Essex has five of these. Look at that colour. Very mermaidial, isn't it? My grandma in her bathroom's got mermaids everywhere. Like big statues of mermaids. Oh, They're amazing. Gosh. I want to inherit yeah, so it's them. It's gorgeous colours, don't they? The mermaid's tails. It's a bit like, a bit like the peacock, isn't it? Really, yeah. with the, the, the luscious blue, blues and silvery greys, and yeah, I love it. Oh, something's occurring in the gallery. What's occurring? So you've just had, who was that on the phone? Scott McBox. And he said you could take the price down. I'm, why? What are you doing? I don't even get it. Why would you? But it's only six ninety five anyway. That was for nothing. I ain't touching that, Kim. You're not allowed to do that. If Lord Bennett's watching now, we're in trouble. If you don't get this now, if this doesn't sell out in a heartbeat, there's some something's wrong. Four pounds ninety five pence. Just the insanity. It's. Are you looking at this? Sheila? Oh, sorry, I've just lost something. I was looking for it. Sorry. Just thinking, where? Right. Sorry, I nodded <laughs> off. I just uh, I've got to wonder it now. Four ninety five. Four ninety five for a strand of Labradorite. Oh, that, that's the Labradorite still. I thought you can... Gosh, that's amazing. But we don't do four ninety five for anything. No, you don't. You know, we're not allowed to, really. Well, there's laws against it. And because you're in the, the family of ownership here, we're going to be bringing you into the meeting if we have one. <laughs> that is just surreal that is it just shows you doesn't it if, yeah. if you don't buy three or four of these I think you're mad don't you absolutely well a lot of people are buying at five at 95 imagine if you were doing a craft fair what you could make I actually think if you had a bead shop you could make a profit on absolutely, this absolutely yeah 
It's it's absolute madness. This is a genuine gemstone strand of labradorite. Four ninety-five. That's just it's madness, isn't it? it? Well, I think it's crazy. No wonder we're selling out now. YTC, oh, I've got a hundred unchecked baskets. You're going to have to check your baskets out, otherwise this will sell out today. Judith's got two, Catherine's got two, Vivian Essex has got two, Claudette's got three. Everyone's multi-buying. I'm thinking mad not to multi-buy, really. Uh, you can send these back. You've got a bottomless basket. You only pay one for the P once for the PMP, so you're not adding uh, the PMP each time for four pounds and ninety-five pence. You've got incredible, incredible value. Now it's time to see what you cheeky little devils have been up to. We're going to go and uh, check your offs out. I love seeing what you've been up to. I want to show you. I love this because you've got the stud earrings. Yes. For yeah, me, I've got more shepherd hooks, but I actually prefer a stud earring yes, binding. Do you? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it keeps it on, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, and it feels kind of more expensive. I don't know why. And also because if if you clip the back closer, it tightens it up as well. Yeah. So. And and you can sit it right. You uh, can uh, sit uh, it sometimes right. Sometimes yeah. your ears start going. Yeah. Well, I've lost many. Yeah. I've lost many earrings. So. Me too. Who hasn't? I've got more one. You know one. More than other pair. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like socks. Yeah, it's no, just a bit, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Number five is from Kate in North Lincolnshire. And Kate writes Hi, all at Jewelry Maker. Here's my entry for the Wall of Fame. I've created a set of rose quartz jewelry for my mum's 75th birthday. Woo! All the gems and um, the sterling silver findings are from Jewelry Maker. Uh, I love the mix of faceted and plain rounds and the different sizes. I hope my mum likes it. She's going to love it. That's Gorgeous, oh, okay, it? it's gorgeous. So, a win would be fabulous. Good luck to you. You're number five. And this is number six. Oh, I love that. I love that. Lovely. I love yeah, the that's photography. a different. Yeah, and the, the link as well. And um, this is from Emma. And Emma says, This is my first entry to the Wall of Fame and my first attempt at chainmail. Chunky bracelet made with shell pearls from Jewelry Maker. That's from Emma. Well done, Emma. Emma, it's gorgeous. Number short six. and sweet. Look at this hand. It looks, is it made out of ice? It is, isn't it? Is it made out of ice, this hand? Oh, I don't know. It will, it will start to look a bit of a funny shape after a I've, few... Put, I've actually filled up um, a rubber glove with water and put it, it in might, the freezer for to make it, it might be, but it, I don't know. It's we'll fab. To, I love the colours. Let's have a look that. Yeah, lot. that's amazing. Number seven is from Monica, and Monica writes, Hi there, jury maker. This is my entry for the Wall of Fame. Magnesite and... Um, I alight from Jewelry Maker, of course. I envy you so much handling all the beautiful things. Lucky me, I can buy some of them. Have a great weekend. Lots of love and sunshine from Monica. And straight back at you. Uh, so we're wondering, Monica, if, if you've done this out of ice, the hand. I like the idea of it. Maybe she's just bought it like that. I just wondered if... But it, yeah. Oh, yeah, that looks like the bottom, that of, the glass. bottom of the glass. Yeah. yeah. <gasps> but who knows? Mm. You never know. I love your handiwork. <laughs> oh, my oh, that was really, really good. bad. Sorry. Yes, it was bad. I'm glad that you liked it. I did. Oh, you were pretending. Yeah. You were no, I wasn't. No, no, no. Um, this is number eight, and these are cufflinks, and this is from Alia? Alia? Alia. 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 Alia Maloney. That's a lovely name, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and Aaliyah says, hope this finds you all well. Had a commission for sterling silver Amazonite cufflinks, so I went on a cufflink making spree. Here are just one of the sets I made. These double ones were made with lapis lazuli, hollow coins and silver plated copper 0.8 wire. All from JM. All the best from Aaliyah. Oh, I love That's that. lovely, lovely name. Very pretty well. name. Uh, very number different. nine, very classic, very wearable, full of texture. Similar to love. The the, what we were selling there. Yeah, it is the different bundle. Different colours, a bundle, yeah. Number nine is from Jackie Harrison in Berkshire. And Jackie writes, Hi all, this is my entry for this week's wall of fame. Um, all jewellery and findings came from Jewellery Maker. I'm doing my first craft fair at my local village hall next week, um, a trial. So really looking forward to it. I uh, love the show and everyone at Jewellery Maker. You're all like one big family and I feel that I'm a part of that. Good Aww. luck to everyone from Jackie. Jackie, you don't say where your... Um, your craft fair is I'd love to have told everyone for you uh, but good luck have fun and, and let us know how it goes you're number nine now after the break we have got loads more treats coming up for you we've got the caramel opal that's Kimmy's pick of the day 
If you would like some more information about how to buy from us here at Jewelry Maker and become one of our insane family, <laughs> uh, then this is how you do it. The fastest way to shop with Jewelry Maker is by going to our website. Just click on the sign up button. Once you've filled in the required details, you can start shopping. You can watch the show by clicking the Watch Live button on the front page. You can also use our refine tool and narrow down your search. Once you've found an item that you like, just simply click on the Buy Now button and the item will be added to your basket. Don't forget you can add as many items to your basket per day and still only pay one p and p Enjoy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that the Jewelry Maker phone number is free from a UK landline? Now you can spend those extra pennies on more shopping. We all know having the right tools for the job is important, so we here at Jewelry Maker have designed a toolkit which includes all your essential pliers for jewelry making, including round nose and flat nose pliers, wire cutters, as well as a bead reamer, snips and tweezers. You've got everything you need for just $9.95. We provide the tools, you provide the skills. Get creative with Jewelry Maker. If you're new to Jewelry Maker, simply contact our call center and we'll send you a tutorial DVD and get started booklet all free of charge. Get involved with Jewelry Maker by sending the studio a message during our live hours. You can send a text to 60777 and start your message with JM Studio or alternatively go to our website and click on watch the live show, simply type your message into the box and press send. Make sure you stay tuned in case your message is read out. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. If for any reason you're not satisfied with your purchase, you have the benefit of our no quibble 30 day money back guarantee. Just complete the returns form enclosed with your goods and send them back for a full refund. Welcome back. You're watching Jewelry Maker. We might do some sneaky competitions, might we, Kim? We might. Uh, now, I'm going to show you our early bed that we had earlier. What would it be in the... Is it what, darling? Oh, no, we're not doing that chain. We're doing this chain, are we? A metre of luscious black spinel chain. I love this. You know what? This is so sparkly. I would do bracelet, necklace earring set out of this you've got a meter so you've got loads of, uh, plenty to play with look at that sparkle you could do a slave bracelet with this couldn't you you could do anklets with this now you've got a meter of it and the thing about these are they've been hand wrapped for you i well i am a big fan of rosary linking but n ain't nobody got time to be doing all that rosary linking Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time though, eh? I ain't got time, have you? Loads of you are in for this. Nettie in Surrey's got two. We got a horse called Nettie down our yard. Said that last time. Not the Erinette, that's short for. Uh, Andrea, you've got yours. Vera, you've got yours. Gillian Belinda, uh, you've got yours. Loads of you there. I'm going to do a sneaky competition later on. What are you going to win? My sock. I haven't got any socks on. <laughs> oh, you blew them off with, with the prices. Oh, right. I thought you were talking about something else. I thought you were talking about blowing off. And I was like, Claire, not now. It's not even 11 o'clock. No one wants blow offs at 5 past 10. OZU D13 is your item code. 
Let's talk about, first of all, the value that's in this strand. You've got black spinel. Spinel for me looks like a dark. These look like black diamonds to me. I'm sorry, but they do. I love them. I've got a black diamond ring and actually these are sparklier than my black diamonds. Do you know that? And actually look at them live. Do you think, guys, that these are... Sorry to call you guys. Hi, guys. Yeah, yeah. I hate it when people call me, guys, guys. Do you think that these are sparklier than some black diamonds? I'm, I'm going to put that out there. I love this. So you've got the black spinel, you've got loads of individual black spinel, but they've also been individually hand wire wrapped. Two loops. First of all, how much would you pay someone to do that? It'd take hours. And they've got a nine karat gold overlay. Actually, I think it's an 18 karat gold overlay, I'm sorry. Even better, even purer. A very expensive looking one whole meter of chain on the phone lines quickly for this one. QZU D13. My eyes are getting old. I was like that. £14.95. pence. So much value in one. Did I say that really Gloucester, did I? Oh, wasn't it Brumay? Oh. £14.95 pence, darling. Darling. Oh, ZU D13, Gordon, you've got yours, Nicole, Madeline, uh, Miss Kathleen, Leslie, you've got yours, Isabel and Angus, you've got yours, uh, Patricia's got two, Joan of the East Ridings of Yorkshire, she's probably one of our poshest of customers, £14, it does sound posh, doesn't it, to come from the East Ridings of Yorkshire, I, I think that sounds very posh, I want to come from there, now, Sorry, Kim's telling me where to go. I, I don't know. I don't know one end of myself from the other. That could be a problem, Claire. They both look pretty similar, let's face it. Now. <laughs> both ends of me, darling, yeah. So I couldn't tell one end of myself from the other. They both look quite similar. <laughs> Imagine if you woke up and your face was in fact your bottom. Now, <laughs> that'd be really inconvenient, wouldn't it? <laughs> but there is a comedy sketch about that, is there? Oh. Now, have a look. Because this is so delight. I always talk about Debbie Balford when I see so delight, because it reminds me of her, because she told me for the first time uh, that this was denim blue and that everyone should get it because most of us have a pair of denim blue jeans therefore we'll be able to make jewelry for our friends and make jewelry that's really easy to sell based on the fact that you can say to your customers well you know what if you don't if you're not sure about what color your friends will go for do they wear blue jeans most of us can say yes to that question well. and a white shirt yeah white shirt mm. i don't have a crisp white shirt I need do you one. not i need one i you do need, i do. need to get a bit classier <laughs> in my wardrobe is what i need to do that's what's going to happen soon you are classy, Jessie. Oh, you always well, wear lovely things. Until I open my mouth. I say lovely things. Is that you what you say? No, yeah, you, no, you look lovely. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You always look lovely. Oh, thank you. Now, these denim blues are luscious, but they also, I don't know why, they remind me of, they give me a memory, which is really, this is probably weird and not anything to do with jewellery, so you know it's going to be a bit weird. They remind me of seals on the rocks. Have you ever been? I've been somewhere and, I, and, and there was sea this colour and there were rocks and the seals were sat on the rocks. I don't know where I was. It's a bit like when I saw the Northern Lights and I can't remember where I was. But I found a man. When I was in Marbella, I was talking to this man. He bought me a handbag, actually. It's a really weird situation. It's a long story. Actually, it's a crazy story. Do you want me to tell it you? It's not that quick, but I'm going to tell it to you anyway. Let's get your price in first, and then I'm going to tell you this story of what happened to me on holiday. So, you've got all these wonderful deep colours. Uh, they do remind me of seals and seasides and things like that. I love this colour. Blue jeans, white crisp shirt, gorgeous expensive heels. Mm, yeah, really. Genuine gemstones. Nice 
if it's a bit cool, a nice black or navy blue sort of jacket goes bit, with it. A, a little bit uh, nautical. Yes. You're a yachter, so we, <laughs> you're right there. We should hang around with her more. <laughs> Six ninety-five for three strands. That's two pounds thirty each. Three double strands. Double. If you've never tried Soda Light, uh, then do it now. It's so delightful. You've got to it have is, Soda Light. It sounds like a pudding, it? Soda Light. I'll take a Soda so Light. So delightful. Please. Yeah. You've got to have it. It's true. So delightful. So delightful. <laughs> That's it. Yeah. Six pounds, 95 pence. So I'm going to tell you this story, all right? I'm going to tell you this story of what happened to me when I was in Marbella. I was innocently with all the girls. It was innocent, because you'll see this. In a restaurant, seafood restaurant, eating my dinner down that's normal see innocent there I was eating my seafood we're like at a raised platform and down here there's quite a lot of people because we were in the big group and there's a little boy his dad and two women right now the dad goes out I think he was gonna have a cigar or something so the little boy starts crying really crying for his daddy well this guy don't know what happened rage got the rage because the boy was crying and shouted really loud at the boy shut up right to which I got the serious rage obviously made this little boy did this right. now if that was my child the man wouldn't have walked out of there so I got, should I be telling this story I got really angry long story short the man has to leave because I made him leave the restaurant the whole restaurant's clapping and this other guy who came from, oh, it's about the Northern Lights. So this other guy uh, who I think came from Norway bought me a handbag to say, well done. You, we all wanted to tell him to leave. You were oh. the only one brave enough. He lifted his shirt up at me and everything, getting really like, Ugh. I was like, oh. get out. Anyway, um, bought me this handbag. And I asked him, I said, where are you from? And I think he said Norway. Yeah, he did. And... Um, I said, I've been somewhere, I tell you this story all the time, but I didn't know where I was. There were Moomins and the Northern Lights. I told him and he was like, yeah, you were in Finland. I was like, yes, thank you. Someone who didn't think I was mad. Pardon, what was that? I got a handbag. I got a handbag and I found out where I'd been. It was a very weird <laughs> night. Six pounds and 95 pence. L-U-G-C-06 is your item code. So delightful is uh, the is the name of this bundle i would do bida kumahimo with that kim would you i would do bida kumahimo with that now kim which number you know you and i were just talking about nautical mm. i've got the most nautical bundle you've ever seen in your life look at this this is lovely now you're a, you are a yachter well i have been on a yacht you've got a family yacht don't play this down if it was me i'd be telling the world you've got a family yacht you go out well on it it's sometimes. not used very much now so but it is a fact it might be going it might be going so uh, no i don't know but the pictures look so amazing oh it is yeah it is. i might have to unfriend you, you all on facebook you then can, if i'm not going to get those yeah. updates anymore you can go on there for like three or four days and you feel as though you've been away for a month do you? It's just beautiful. Well, you've, when you're out there on the sea, peaceful. you just... You you see it's dolphins so peaceful. Ever. Yeah, I've seen dolphins a couple of times, but you have to be quick. But absolutely beautiful, and it's just so tranquil because nobody can get to you, nobody can... You know, so you just forget yourself and... I've got a question, sorry. Go on then. Is it like, do you have to tell somebody where you're going, or can you just roam across no, the sea? No, you, you have to, you have to, yeah, tell them radio what your plan and, is, and like on an and nautical equipment and things, so yes, you do have to. Uh, where is yours moored, and where do you go to? I can't remember now where it is. I think it's, do you it's normally abroad go to France? somewhere. France? Uh, yeah, France, yes, yeah, You've been to Saint-Tropez, haven't you, in it? No, I haven't been to Saint-Tropez in it. I didn't get no. I didn't, didn't get, get to go. That I didn't get to go to that one. Do you ever pass celebrities? No, never. Bet you do. Bet well, you do. No, never. No. I don't think she's I paying have. this down. I'm, not, I'm telling you, she's mingling with the best of them. This one, she's been up there with on James Bond Island and the lot. I bet. Did you. I tell you where I got recognised the other day? Where? At the tip. What? <laughs> Sheila with a on the window. Yeah. You're from jewellery maker. I says, yeah. He said, oh, my wife just recognised you. I said, oh, I'll come and have a chat. So I go to the most salubrious places. Oh. And then you meet people at the dip. 
<laughs> oh dear. Uh, well, uh -huh. I can't afford a boat like Sheila. I can't afford a boat either. I can't even afford a dinghy or a. Well, you've done no. it by association. I'm so lucky keep enough going. to be able to. Yes, and keep I'm very going. Lucky. I ride off my brother's coattails. It's all fine. It's actually much better. It's less pressure when it's someone else's. It is. It is a lot of pressure. It. And cost no. a lot. Yeah. Gosh. Look at this. I love. I mean, it's this. not. A, you know, it's it's not a, like a big like white big huge that sort of yacht. It's more like a boating. Listen, yacht it's very, it's boat. an exclusive yacht. I would be like, woohoo! It's like a yacht that's moored in Marbella. That's what it's like. It's got a very tall mast, yeah, it has. It's got a very tall mast. <laughs> now, have a look. <laughs> I can hear them in the gallery now. <laughs> They're rascals in that gallery. I love I these realized colours. What I said then. Now, what really makes this nautical? is these ship's helms that I can't pick up. Here we go. And they're solid sterling silver. There we are. I love those. They're so cute, aren't they? Did we used to have music going on in the background while I was talking? What's happened to that music? People didn't like it. Oh. Now, how many of these do I get? Ten. Solid sterling silver charms it says five pieces on my but you get two lots of five so ignore that on your screens definitely get ten I love these so you got a meter each of the cord and it's studded cord now this looks great on shoes round ankles round your wrists it's wonderful sewn in as well and we got a text message from Debbie in my shire you could use those as connectors. Yes. Which as connectors? As the, the ship's helms as connectors? Do you think she means? I've, I've used them as well, Jenny, from the uh, ribbon findings, you know, the endings that you can, because you can actually these, you can, you can actually so put use them those inside with these. those to connect them, to put them on there, and then you can have them dropping at different lengths. If I do, these are the ribbon endings that you get. There we are, keeping like the oh perfect. So just fold so them just, over. So just put them inside there, fold it over, and then you can have them dropping at different lengths. You can then put a gemstone on the top, and then you can put it on some chain and have it coming cascading in different lengths. It looks lovely. I mm. love I'm a big fan of this cord. Mm. And it I really think it's does. really funky. I think it's quite um fashionable as well, isn't it? Mm. £12.95 pence. I love these colours effortless jewellery making all you need to do is just put a clasp on these I think they're going to look fantastic 10 of those solid sterling silver ship's mask charms they gorgeous text us in have you ever been on a boat what was the other thing have you ever had a, a restaurant situation have you or airport so I had that restaurant situation and then that man literally followed us around for the rest of the holiday it was brilliant, yeah. Because he kept buying us all drinks. Oh, wow. Yeah, all off the back of that. You shouldn't shout at children in restaurants. Not other like people's that. I mean, poor thing. What a shame. It was a shame. £12.95. He, sh he shouldn't have left him anyway. No, it wasn't the dad that was shouting. It was somebody else. Wasn't the dad? The dad went out to have oh, a cigar, I see. and it was someone sat at the next table. The table. Oh, oh but he still shouldn't have left him. It wasn't even his own child. If someone else shouted at my child, to be sure that I would go mad. So didn't his dad come in? He did, but he had to keep calm. I told him, right, keep calm, yeah. I'll handle this. Oh, uh, right, I'm with you now. I don't want men fighting. So I did it for him. Oh, now. well done you. <laughs> it's time for that amazing Topaz. It's Spotlight Deal time. <laughs> I love this. I'm gonna I'm gonna say to me this is Swiss blue topaz. To me, London blue topaz is a lot deeper. So I'm gonna say this is Swiss blue topaz if you don't mind. Look at it. We're all in agreement. I love it. I love this colour. It's crisp. And it's uh, do you know what? It is that Tiffany blue, isn't it? It do you think it's Tiffany blue? I do. I love this. I love this. And it's the sort of thing you might see at Tiffany Cartier Boodles, isn't it? What a colour. What a colour. Just think about this. I know I'm mentioning brands here. But if you ever go in Swivel Ovalovsky, 
You know what I mean, the crystal shop with all the bling. Swivelovolosky. Have you seen how expensive it is for glass that's coloured? And, and okay, some of the designs are really pretty. I think people are a bit over Swivelovolosky now though, aren't they? They're not really doing it anymore. This, this colour is genuine Swiss blue topaz. It's for earrings and for rings and for clusters. I love this. It's for charm bracelets. Have a look at this wonderful colour. Have a look at those facets. Look at the clarity. Now, again, I would, in fact, say, because I don't want you to get this home and, and say, well, actually, I've compared it to the London Blue Topaz that I've got. It's a lot lighter. Yes, I would say that it's Swiss blue topaz, so you've got a different look entirely, but it will mix beautifully with London blue. Uh, I love any topaz, but particularly the blue topaz are my favourite. Swiss blue topaz gives you that crisp sky. Have you ever looked up at the sky just after it's been snowing and it is as blue as blue as blue? That's what this reminds me of. It's that swimming pool blue on holiday when you're so hot and the only thing to do is dive into that refreshing pool. It's that kind of blue, isn't it? It's Sheila's ocean yacht blue. Isn't it gorgeous? That, I, I, I don't know. I that is absolutely exquisite. It really, really is. You can't, the sparkle, I mean, I was sort of looking at the screen and yet I can see that I can see it sparkling from the side. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful, isn't it? Go lovely with mine with the next um it will be beautiful with your next okay. i think this can be very very bridal absolutely could be your something blue couldn't it i do think this is going to be absolutely charming if you use this as a pendant on a long sterling silver chain or a shorter chain if you're wearing it with your bridal piece i think this is going to be stunning in your tiara and fascinator your earrings and your necklace all at the same time maybe sewn into a garter as well. Hate the word garter. It should be called something a lot sexier, a garter. What, what else they call it? Not a leg necklace, something to do with stockings or something, something sexier than garter. CQC 148, 79 pounds and 95 pence. This is genuine topaz with a 30 day money back guarantee. Go and get it valued if you wish to. You absolutely can. 35 carats of beautiful, I think, Swiss blue topaz. These drops are five to eight millimeters. And they are on a seven centimeters strand are they is that only seven centimeters you get a lot to the strands they're all packed together though aren't they 79 pounds and 95 pence remember that 30 day money back guarantee as well now i'm going to give to you some sterling silver toggle clasps Now, if you've been using the high-end gemstones and you're creating things like bracelets or chunkier necklaces, then it's a toggle clasp you're going to go for. If you're looking to work with a chain and you want a nice fine um, finding, then go with a bolt ring and clasp. But for me, if you're using big chunky gemstones or if you really, really want to keep hold of something, you don't want the piece of jewellery to break, maybe you've got big chunky turquoise, I'd go for this every day of the week. They're solid stone silver, so they're going to add that certain value to your pieces as well. Let's have a look at what I've got. Two pairs, or three pairs actually, what am I saying? A toggle class. These are also grand to be using for cufflinks. I always forget the word for cufflinks. So you can also use them for cufflinks. Isn't that fantastic? In solid sterling silver. Now grab these findings because these our solid sterling silver does tend to sell out really quickly. Sheila, where would you use these? Oh, well, I've I've used them at the bottom of the necklace as well. You know where you have it. So as you a feature, you can use it asymmetrical. You can actually use it at the bottom, and if you've got a few of them, you can actually make it so that you've got one of the tiny little um, bolt ring clasps, and you can interchange. 
oh, and have like different idea. have different yeah. um you can keep the necklace as it is but then maybe have some different um embellishment like going. pendants or mm. whatever you want to call them you know with a cascade of, of gemstones and things that, but, but you can change so you I sort love of that idea yeah it's multi-use of those really so they are a multi-purpose yeah. um, finding they are toggle class but you don't have to you're not set in stone at what you use them for so take your findings and and think outside of the box exactly. think what else could i be doing exactly. with these exactly and and maybe have like a cascade of the gemstones and interlink them with uh, you know some basic loops but they just look so lovely really really full of gemstones hanging from either your chain or for your um however you've designed your necklace and just just change them to match the colors of your i love the idea wearing. that you can interchange things i love the idea that these can be that's the word I was interchangeable uh, i love the idea that these can be a feature rather than just a finding yes, exactly. as well and, and i don't think you'd make a feature out of a bolt ring class but i certainly think you would make a feature oh, out well, of a I toggle have, class I, I have a few times yeah. yeah definitely and i know linda has you know linda quite quite likes the um, asymmetrical design I yeah so this would be a feature whereas you yeah. wouldn't have that benefit with a um with no, no, a no. bolt ring cast because that no. sort of always sits at the, well, at the that's base right, of the neck that's doesn't right. it but i mean you can even if you've got them at the back you can put an extra long especially if you've got a dress that's oh, really back, yeah. you know, backless then you can pop a long piece of chain on and then you can add some gemstones so it just dangles in that where it just like the chanel advert yes oh i love that yes. Sheila in Gloucestershire has three of these. Karen in County Down has two. Uh, jewelry maker in Kent, you've got yours. Karen in Hampshire. Jewelry maker in Essex. Loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of you there. M too many to mention. UAR F40. £8.95. There is a queue on the phone lines I'm hearing, but it is a free phone number if you're dialing from a UK landline. Uh, if you are shopping from abroad, please click uh, above on the right hand side. Just bring the flag down and it'll ship to your country. I'll tell you, work it all out for you. £2.95 is all you pay in the United Kingdom for items to be shipped. And that is a bottomless basket all the way up until midnight. So it doesn't matter how much you pack in there. It's just £2.95 all the way up till midnight. We will, if you keep checking out your baskets in between, we'll work it out before we ship tomorrow. Please don't worry. £8.95. Loads of you there. Let me give you a recap as well while we're at it of our early bird. An American then at the end. I don't know. I'm, I'm now I'm Iggy Azalea. I'm obsessed with. I'm obsessed with listening to Iggy Azalea's voice. She's like some pop star that little kids. Do I like her song? I don't think she should have done that with Britney. I ain't being funny, but you're cooler than that, Iggy. Not anymore though. Ruined it now. Did you hear on the news that um, a British guy from Yorkshire has had a whole body of tattoos of Miley Cyrus? Now listen really? to this. Miley Cyrus has re um, responded to his tattoos by saying they're creepy and they make her look really ugly. So he's now spending three thousand pounds having them removed because <laughs> she was like, "That's really creepy. I'm creeped out by that." And he was like, "Oh no!" And apparently he was finding it really hard to get a girlfriend because he was covered <laughs> in Miley Cyrus. Obviously, yes. why would you do I that? Wonder. Yeah. Why? Strong. Why would a tattoo artist go, "Yeah, great idea," and then I'm blaming them slightly as well. <laughs> Oh, mind you, you've got to earn a living, haven't you? Can't be refusing work. Now, have a look at this. We don't have many of these left, and in fact, I have so many. How many unchecked baskets did we have? Loads. Over 30 unchecked baskets for this. Now, this is solid sterling silver with a nine karat gold overlay, and it's a nice substantial chain, and you've got a meter of it. So if you weren't up this morning because you were having a lion, first of all, I'd like to tell you I'm very jealous. I'm going to have my first lion in months tomorrow morning. And I shall tell you for why. Yours is Monday. I'll tell you why. Now, normally I'd have to get up every day without fail, Claire, because, I got, because of the kids and the horses. But tomorrow, my car, the alternator went yesterday, right in the middle of hitching. And uh, so I borrowed my friend's car. I ain't got a car, so I can't get up to do the horses. I was like this. No, I wasn't. I was like, oh. And do you know what was happening? I'd broken down. People were beeping me. I was like, I've broken okay, down. I'm not <laughs> just parked here. <laughs> Drive cheap. <laughs> what? Do that again. Aegis. Now. <laughs> <laughs> 
what's wrong with people? Don't beep at people who've broken down. Help them. I had somebody the other day that was, he was, he wasn't going as far as I was, and he was right, right next to my. You know, he couldn't have got any closer. And it really infuriates you when you're driving and you've got people that are sort of right at the back of you, because they could go into you at any time. Well, and, actually, if they uh, do go into the back of you, I said uh, I it's automatically their fault because you could should always be two car lengths. Uh, I was someone. so cross, you know, and I wasn't crawling. I was just going at the right speed, and oh, it just got me so. People mad. are impatient, though, aren't they? Like that. I don't get me started. No, I got my, my granddaughter. My thing about people who oh, no. I wait for them and I they don't gonna... say thank you. I am my white window. Yeah, and yeah, welcome. <laughs> we road rage. Rage is on. I literally hang out the window thank and go, God. say thank you. <laughs> Manners. <laughs> <laughs> they just pass and they look miserable, and you're thinking, I've waited for you to go, go. Yeah. You know, and they just oh, drive you mad. You know, I oh, tell you what. And then I tell you what, going like 22 miles an hour yeah. on a 50 oh, mile. And then they're Sorry, hesitating. You're like, like forget it, love. Forget <laughs> it. I wish I hadn't done Oh, it. I know. Especially in the morning when you're trying to get to work. Oh, I know. oh it always is, isn't it? IYP, Kia 30, as you rate them called. 14.95 for a whole metre of chain. How much would you pay just for 18 inches? How much would you pay for that? You've got a whole metre here at £14.95, IYP Q30. Uh, so many of you now coming through on this. Now, don't forget, I did have 30 unchecked baskets. Oh, there's a Mia from Greater Manchester. It's a good name, isn't it, Mia? I chose that for my firstborn. Uh, it's hard, uh, Kim, when you do bear the baby of Philip, you will find it very difficult to find a name for that first. Oh, you've got names. Go on. Why well, they're not hanging about, are they, really? They're not. Well, Kim's not getting any younger, is she? <laughs> <laughs> Her ovaries are twitching. <laughs> uh, Fourteen ninety-five. I'd have a million kids if I could, like, afford bear it. them. Yeah. I wouldn't want to have it. I would have more now if you just handed me the baby. I wouldn't want to do the whole pregnant thing again. So here you go. You've had this. I'd be like, yes. I, I wonder what annoys other people. We ought to have a text in. What annoys, annoys you? you the most? Do you get road rage? Something like cues as well. When I always choose the wrong queue, I do. What you is know, this? I can go Why don't you go to a different country? Why don't they know how to queue? Why do they all just go in and you're like, hello, I was here first. What's that about? Did you, you hear about that on, the, on a, a certain um, supermarkets? They put some meat out. Did you hear about that? No. News, yeah. What and happened? It, well, it was still in date, but it was a special offer. But there was like a. There was like, yeah, they were gate crashing and like in IKEA when they had that sofa and people started. Yeah, they were going each mad. Other, but I mean, there was plenty of it, but they were grabbing like six bags of it. And Where things was it? I, I can't. Oh, I don't. I can't remember. But is I it know the blue and white one, or is it the green one, or is it the, is it one of the German ones? No. No, it's kind of the, you know, really popular sort of. Oh, with the orange one. I can't remember. I'm not committing. Myself. She's rubbish at telling us. I want to go and get that meat deal. <laughs> <laughs> but they were literally almost fighting. Yeah. Hey, really? Were you there? Or was no, it the no, it's what uh, on the news. No, I wasn't there. No, People this 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 guy had photographed it, um, videoed it on his camera. People are cray cray, aren't they? Now, madness. What, mad, well, life is mad. What are you saying, Kim? Now, I want you. To see. Now, this is a new thing for me. Fishes. Aww. Are these new laces? I love the heart. I love the. Oh, look at that. Oh, that'd be beautiful at the base of a dress with mm. someone with a really sexy back. Put that there. You're, this, you'd look you, good in this, a Claire. gorgeous colour as well. Absolutely beautiful. What a colour. Oh, I love this. Claire, let's make you a beautiful dress with this at the back. Maybe your wedding dress to Danny. What are you puffing at? They always say they don't want to get married, right, at the beginning, and then by the end they're on their knees begging you. They say that because they're like, I don't want to get married. Yeah, all right, are you trying to convince yourself or me? No one said anything about marriage. If he's told you already he doesn't want to get married, he wants to. Now, guarantee it. Look at the fishes. Kim, you didn't want to get married and then Phil's asking you to please be open-minded about it. Is that what you just said? 
You're definitely going to marry Phil, probably on a cruise ship. Am I going to be your bridesmaid? Because I did push you together. I did force you together. Your firstborn child. Like, it's like an episode of Rumpelstiltskin. You must call your firstborn child after me. The whole name, Jenny Cleary. I don't think you should do that. I'm not sure about Cleary. It's bugged me all my life. You like Cleary. But people call you Clearasil and stuff like that. It's really annoying. And Clary. Anyway, back to the lace. So, what are the, so do, what do you think these fishes symbolise? I love it. It's a bit, is it, um... Well, I was going to think, and I thought Gemini was crabs. Um, no, I think it's they uh, are fishes, Chinese. Yeah, that, that's my star sign, Pisces. Oh, it's Pisces. Pisces, yeah. Oh, I love it. Are you a Pisces? Yeah. Oh, you're a fish out of water. Yeah, that's probably right. <laughs> Look at that. I love the heart. Look at the intricate work as well. The heart then lead into that surround. This is very good bridal quality lace. And now, if you, excuse me, Jen, if you see where the, where it's you've got those frayed edges. Well, they, they aren't frayed. It's just the way it's, it's cut, I think. But I snip those off. So I've snipped those edges off, going round those little circles around the outside. I've snipped neatness. those off. I quite like them though. And then I've, in the fascinator I've done, I've just um, really stiffened it really, really hard, you know, for a and long you, time. You've stiffened it with PVA glue. Yeah, yeah. Pop it on the radiator. That's right, yeah. Now I'm going to give it. And it dries in about 15 minutes. 15 minutes really quick, isn't it? Because, you know, we're impatient sometimes, aren't we? Uh, now, I love this. Look at that. Now, my auntie has seen our uh, lace and she makes wedding gowns. And she told me that actually some of this is uh, some of ours is actually better quality the than the be stuff she gets through. It's the best. It's the best quality when I was sourcing it that I, I have seen, and I did you know source it and get some before, and um, and it was nothing. It wasn't nothing like the quality we have, and it was twice the price. So nothing actually, like the quality. Actually, that didn't make a nice foot um, decorative piece, wouldn't it? On maybe some flip flops. If you stiffened it really, really hard, you could have those two bottom bits going round your toe. I love the idea of a fascinator with this. Oh, yes. what you've done, isn't yes, it? Yes, what, what I've done. done, yeah. I'm definitely going to be wearing that. Now, let me show you, because what, what's this? What's, what's this? What is this? What is this? this? Are these little connectors? <gasps> They're three hole connectors. Are these brand new? I'm obsessed. Did you get these They're with beautiful. The I am yeah. obsessed. Right, you know how much I love a three-hole connector. But look, 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 look. Little roses, aren't they beautiful? You've got three holes. Oh, you need these. You have to have this. I've never seen these, but Kim's just said to me, these have been on a few times before. All right, Kim. Why don't you just... But for those that didn't buy them, bonfire. yeah. But they are stunning. I love them. I'm so excited about these. I've never seen them, jewellery makers, even if Kim thinks she has. Of course they're ridiculous. How can I show the holes? You need to be able to see them. So they've got the three holes here, here, and here. Can you see the hole? Oh, not now I dropped them, you blooming cunt. And then you get real pearls. I don't know how I can show them, but they are not just, just know that they have three holes on them. Genuine pearls. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ten of those. Now, have, oh, I to, forgot to show you another piece of lace. Isn't that pretty? Right, now you've got two cabochons. Look at this colour. Oh, this is wonderful. Really oceanic. I'm into my blues now. And you've got that long white chalcedony as well. Look at this. Definite tropical selection of gemstones. You've got beautiful strand of neon appetite. Love. Shell pearl. Now, shell pearl, the benefit of that. Sheila and I were actually talking about shell pearl before the show. Uh, we love it because we know that you get that perfect round. And you can facet these. You wouldn't be able to facet a real pearl. No. Because it wouldn't work. It would crumble. Oh, I love having real pearls. Shell pearl, I know I'm guaranteed something that's a really great quality in a, in a different kind of facet that I would get in a real pearl. I'm going to get perfection, but I'm still not going to compromise with pearlescence. I'm still going to get pearlescence. You've got a beautiful blue cow said me. Wonderful um, cloudy blue agate there as well. I love this bundle. I love this kit. All yours. You've got 10 sterling silver findings in there as well. 10 half drilled pearls. 
two cabochons. This is very bountiful. £49.95. You've got so much in here. Loads. All that gorgeous lace. Let's get on over to that lovely lady and have a look at all of the pieces that have been created. Very, very Ascot. Very Ascot. I'm trying to, can I just see if I can show you those three holes? I am sorry to Mateo on cameras. There, yay, you can finally see them. It was in my angle, I am sorry about that. And the benefit of this is you can actually, um, you can make a plaited piece and you can change the gemstone order over, but also it keeps great order. But they're so pretty. If you wanted to do like a three row pearl bracelet, pearl necklace, you can keep the order on that. Uh, let's go over and have a bit of ascot time. I'm just taking receipt of a Tamsinite cabochon, I want you all to know. There's loads of craziness going on. We want to do it now, aren't we going to go and see Sheila first? We're going to do the Tamsinite cabochon first and then we're going to... All right, you're too excited, all right. You're as bad as my son the other week on his birthday, trying to open his presents the day before. Where is it? Oh, it's here! Have you seen it? It's actually lush! It's so, it's got so much, so much pink in it, you're not going to believe this. You have to have this. If you don't get this today, you'll never, you, what we were saying earlier, you'll always think about it. I want to be able to show you the player chrism in this, so I'm going to try and hold on to it with some tweezers. No, I'm not going to do that. I don't want to drop it. <gasps> Unbelievable. I want to show you the pinks. It's so difficult to show you when I've, when I've got it in my hand, though, because the skin behind it. Look at this. It's a Tanzanite cabochon, and it's absolutely huge. I've never seen anything like this on Jewelry Maker, ever, ever, ever. You have to make a ring out of this prong set it. Alison Tarry, you were up very early this morning, I know because you commented on something on Facebook, um, and you need this. You have to prong set it into a ring. You'd go to stud earrings with two. Are you mad? Yeah, you know, I would do that, but it's very, um, what's the word when you're just like, I don't care, I'm doing it. It's very lavish. Oh, Claire, who do you think you are, Victoria Beckham? You do. I do actually. Oh my gosh, you have to have this. I've never seen a Tanzanite cabochon in all my life here at Jewelry Maker. So you've got that flat. Ed Look, can you can see the pinks in this? Can you? This has got to be expensive. This is the best Tanzanite colour wise. I do have a torch, it's true. Do I put it behind? Oh, look at the pinks that you get. This is so, so exclusive. Oh, my gosh. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? It's absolutely. Well, it's, it's very mystical, isn't it? If you look at it, it's almost like... Uh, it's just stunning. I love it. It's under £100. Under £100. You've got 10 carats. Perfectly 14 millimetre round. You need this. Now, this is different to one that you might have seen before because it's deeper in colour. You are getting a lot of pink. A lot. You need to get this now. I, I, I think you need to consider this is going under £100, so it's a super value already. But I, I know that you need to consider the quality. This is... Right, I'm just hearing that every in everybody's opinion... This is the deepest blue and the most expensive looking cabochon in Tanzanite that we have ever had here at Jewelry Maker. Now, it's the first time I've ever seen uh, a cabochon. You had one yesterday. Um, everybody's buzzword was yesterday was amazing. This one could be even better. This one is outstanding. You can always choose which one you want if you've got both and send the other one back. The pink's in this, undeniably wonderful. 64 95 to get it under £100 is a massive treat. We're talking about one of the world's 
if not well, arguably the world's most exclusive gemstone mined in one mine once it's gone it's gone in the world 64 pounds and 95 pence xlp 06 is your item code 64 pounds and 95 pence 0800 6 triple 4 6 double 5 all the w's dot jurymaker.com carol jeffrey sue jurymaker in sussex carmarthenshire sarah in worcestershire jacqueline in cumbria jurymaker in gloucestershire you've got to be quick we don't have loads of these as you can imagine how many were ever made <gasps> a very low amount remains you're going to need to be very quick because we are going to give you an introductory price tag you can't deny that that is lush get it now under 50 pounds never guaranteed to see this again ever never yesterday's sold out today's I think is going to do the same this is something that we do not see often. Make sure you're checking out baskets now. XLP 06, 10 carats of genuine tanzanite, and that's in one piece. They don't do graded tanzanite at the Tiffany & Co I went to, and the color is not dissimilar. And we're talking thousands and thousands. Right, I've got so many in baskets, this could sell out, but if you don't check out a basket, this will not be guaranteed to get to you. Kimberly, Stella, Rosemary, Sarah, uh, Stella in Somerset, uh, you've got two. Uh, Kimberly in Gloucester, you need to check out your basket. Linda, Rose, uh, Susan, Rosemary, Joy Maker in Carmarthenshire. Loads of you there, Sarah in Worcester, you've got to check out your basket. I'm going to take this over to Sheila and see what she thinks. This is so pink, you're going to love it. Let's come on over to Sheila and have a look at the designs from the kit today. The tons of night on there Isn't it as lush? Well. I mean, look Gorgeous. at that. That is stunning, isn't Colour it? Colour is amazing. I think I'd want it in it's a almost, ring. It's almost like a... Can you see the, the round circle in the middle? That's almost like a druzy big... Can you see it round there? It's look, amazing. Can you see the different colours yeah. going round? I don't know really if you can see it on there, but... Yeah. I love it. Can. I love it's it. gorgeous. Now, let's have a look at the jewellery from the kit before the Tanzanite. Check this out. Now, if you are going to ask it... Now, actually, something... Sorry, you've pinned it on there. Something have, that yeah. Sheila is amazing at is fascinators. This is wonderful. And it just shows you what you can do um, that's different with the lace. You know, I wanted to do something, and especially with the heart shape, because it's such a it's such a large piece that you can actually stand. So I really stiffened that, re this section there. I really stiffened that really, really. Oh, gosh, yes, it yeah. worked really well. And, um, and then I backed it at the back with some of the gemstones just to give it that extra and then I, I did cut some of the um, because to cover it you need to have the right pieces coming down mm -hmm. from the fascinator um, so I just cut some of the, but I, I didn't use there was quite well there was quite a few that I didn't use but I cut some out of the larger piece there that we have at the bottom um, so I just used various those lovely with your dress well I was thinking that's why I was trying to take it off Let's you see there's the pin there I wish we were at Ascot do you I think it's got to go this you, side. You've got it? thick hair. Haven't I haven't. It's so. as thin as anything. I'm balding, if anything. Oh, it I love needs it. To be further Let's on go up, to the really. races. I love it. It's just, and it's such a. Have you got any champagne, darling? <laughs> no, I wish I had because I'd love a glass right now, actually. I'd love a glass right now. Yes, I, yes, oh. I would. I no. think what's his name might like that. Who's what's his name? You know the one that's on there. What's his name that does the? Yeah, uh, uh, used to do the program where he used to take ladies and he used to sort of you know give them a different look. What's his name? Got quite. Doc, that's it. Oh yeah, he's yeah, there. He's, he's there, there at the, there at the moment. Yeah. yeah. So it's just a different way to show you how to use the lace. I love it. And have a look at all of these beautiful designs. They are absolutely stunning. Of course, all of Sheila's jewellery will be going on to our Facebook page. There you go. Do not worry. Thanks. Yeah, and also, uh, this, what have this you done this on the back of? Where did you get that? Oh, it's it's what I had at home actually um, that I used. But we are looking at getting some um, cinema to actually make these. Where would I get them from? A, ha oh. a haberdashery or something? Yes. Do you want to put that on yes. But we are we are we are looking we are looking into that at the moment because. There's so many different things and so many hats that you can do and different. Oh, I love it. So I love it. And everyone's into wearing enough. those sorts yes, of things. Yes, absolutely. Well. And, uh, and 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 the, the the piece there, I've done that as a. Oops, this one here. The little crown. It's, oh, I no, love it, no, that. I've done it for here at the front. There we go. Yeah, love it. So you can have that there, like. Oh, I've that. got a big you forehead. Can have some chain. You can have some chain on it then. That's what everyone's having with mm. the. Yeah. 
What about an Eid piece? Or you can have it, or you can have it on your head. You know, it's. Um, but yeah, it's just just a different way of using the wire and. I love yeah, it. Weddings and so proms beautiful. And, yeah, yes, and proms mm. definitely. Mia's uh, friend's fasting at the Ooh. moment, so she's um, her head's Mia's not, not allowed to eat enough. in front of her. Mia's like, when's Eid? I don't like this fasting thing. Oh, right. Because um, she's been making Eid jewellery with her friend Sakina. Mm -hmm. And um, I've got that caught on there, look. Oh, the I just ring. love them. The headpieces are wonderful. They're just so beautiful. Just hold out there and I'm like, whoops. Yeah, sorry, look there. The but, head's um, not heavy enough, look. Yeah, boof. Uh, Stella's bought two thinking earrings exactly the same as Claire. And I was saying, a bit elaborate, Claire. I feel like Victoria Beckham, but please let us see what. Uh, well, you can do prom set them, I think. Into stud earrings would be amazing, wouldn't it? Absolutely fabulous. Now, what was that, Kim? What are you saying to us? We, would, we just got the hairpiece caught. That's what would happen. Oh, can you talk us through a piece of jewellery that you've made, please? Um what i it depends really i mean if you want to the, the pendants here that i've actually done i've actually stuck those on okay um because with a really really strong glue was it the epoxy glue yes, on our website was, yes yes it was and um and also don't be afraid to actually cut the um lace you know it, it is lovely that very large piece over there um that can be as you said made into a dress or maybe onto a jumper and it, it, it just, I think this colour is such a gorgeous colour. We haven't had this colour before. Um, this gorgeous sort of, it's light blue, but I've, once, once you actually um, do uh, glue, glue it, soak it in the P, PVA glue, mm -hmm. then it will go a little bit darker so you can have the lighter variation on the ends and then the darker colour. I'm a, I'm a big fan of that colour. I, I, th I think that the lace is... I, I love the lace and I love it to use with the bridal. Um, but I mean, this this could be for mother of the bride. It could be for the mother of the bridegroom. You know, the um, the sort of ne and what I did with this one, I I uh, wire wrapped the pendant first and then just popped it on. I love onto it. some of the lace. It, it's just and it. I want to do some corsages with the lace as well. Oh yes. Mm, yeah, that's my next challenge to me. <laughs> Keep challenging it. Susan sent us a question for you. How is the blue fascinator fixed to the hair? It's got a, comb, a comb underneath. It's a yeah, comb. it's got yeah. a comb underneath. Yeah. Should so we show like, that actually? Yeah, it's, it's a gold one because we've just spent ages one. putting that back in, haven't we? Yeah. I don't think it needs to be silver. I don't think it matters. No, it doesn't really matter. Really, I've just you've sewn it on with monofilament. I've sewn it on with monofilament. Yeah, because that's really, really strong. So, um, so yeah. So and it fixes fits it into a, the hair. Mm. I run out of gemstones there. Otherwise, I would have put some more of the. Um, well, I actually think it's nice and subtle like that. Mm. And then those are the flat half half drilled that I popped on and just glued those on. They look so beautiful. Oh, I really want to go to ask it. I'm going to go next year. XLP 06 is your item code. Now, thank you so much. I'm You're going welcome. to go back over okay. and I shall see you at the waft. See you in a minute. I'll yeah. meet you when we waft together. When we waft. Uh, now, <laughs> I'm going to give this to Amelia. There you go, love. <laughs> Uh, she's very quiet today. She's not wagging her tail as much today. She's not wagging her tail. She's not. Now, I'm going to give to you. What shall we do? Let's do the fluorite. Fluorite, I think, is a. Uh, oh, do you know what? This will go, won't it, with my dress? Love this. Look, look at that sparkle. I love it. Fluorite is lush. Look at this. Because you get this inner fluorescence. It's where the, the word uh, fluorescent came from, fluorite, because it glows. It's got this inner glow. It's amazing. Uh, now, these are rondelles, so they are all fasted around the edge, and these are going to be perfect for making a simple a beaded bracelet, perfect for surrounding cabochons, perfect 
For so, uh, a three-stranded weave, these look amazing in, don't they? I just love it. And Flora is, I mean, look at these colours. These are the colours of summer, aren't they? These pastel cool colours. They're not overwhelming. They're not overpowering. They're pretty. They're delicate. They're like a little butterfly of colour. Uh, GRG P90 is your item. Get 150 carats. Gurg. Uh, 150 carats. These are seven by five on the nose. Everyone's motivating what you do in there, you little cheeky dev. Are you ready? Just get it. Listen, this is genuine flora. It shouldn't be that price tag it is. If you take this under UV light, it will glow and it will do it naturally. Lush. £6.95. I haven't been thrown to a nightclub in years, Kim. Oh, it's not a nightclub in Marbella. You stay on the beach and they carry on partying. There's like flame people what is it when they throw flows flames yeah i can't say it flamethrowers all sorts of crazy stuff is going on in mob smiler yeah uh, flamethrowers <laughs> 6.95 grg p90 vivian's got two uh, sharon's got three jury maker in devon's got two duncan uh, parvinda jenny margaret jill Janina, you've got yours as well. Six pounds and ninety-five pence. I love these colours. Do you know these are gonna look very nice with a bit of lilac? That's nice, isn't it? Who's going on holiday this year? Are you going on holiday, Mateo? Uh, yeah, I don't know where you're calling next week. Cornwall, whereabouts in Cornwall? I oh, love nice Saint Ives, it's so pretty. Who's going? You and your girl? I love all the cobbled streets. Have you been before? Yeah. <gasps> You're going to love oh, it. It's so beautiful. pretty. Isn't it pretty? Mm, Go to Fat Willies. <laughs> it's a surf shack. Take a picture of it for me. Okay. Do you remember? Have you been to St. Ives, Kim? Have you been to St. Ives? Have you been to Fat Willies Surf Shack? What's it? What's it? What does it? It's what? Fat Willie's Surf Shack. Sur ah. It's a surf shop and everyone used to have the t-shirt. Don't you remember? Saying Fat Willie's across it. He was oh, a guy yes, called I do. William. Yes, I do. Yes, and he was yes. a big chap. Yes, I do. Yes. Hence the name of the shop. You remember what in St. Ives? Boom Bar. Foo Bar. I don't know what that is. You're younger than me. Are you going on holiday, Kimberly? Where were you the other day by the seaside? Oh, Aberystwyth. I love Wales, I do. It's pretty, isn't it? I want to go Barry, I do. Oh, Philip got the best room. On the seafront. <laughs> I think he was thinking of proposing. And Clara, of course, is going to Australia soon. When are you... Three weeks. Gonna... It's so cold there at the moment, Claire. But you've been there before, so it doesn't matter. You'll see Wales. She'll see Wales. She's booked so many trips. We're all excited. I'm going to Italy, which I've never been to before. Uh, I've been to Italy before, but I'm going to in between Pisa and Florence. I might go and see that leaning tower. Oh, it's Imagine beautiful. if I leant on it and it's it fell over. Yeah, Is it? Yeah, it's, it's beautiful. Amazing. Some lovely nice bars around the corner there. Well. Are there? But Whole yeah. families go and you in. You can sit and watch. It's lovely to people. Yeah, you'll love it. Mm. I can't wait. I can't wait. Now, uh, it's time not to talk about what we're up to, but to have a look at what you've been waffing up to. All of it, unbelievable. Work of art, that. I love this. Mm, I'd put that around my ankle, I would. <laughs> yes, yes. Number 10, Emma from Dudley, Lush. I love this. Hi, everyone at Jewelry Maker. This is my first uh, time making jewelry. Wow. You're amazing, uh, Emma. You're amazing. I love it. I put the TV on in my room one morning and Jewelry Maker came on and I was hooked instantly. I never looked back. We pop up, don't we? 
We just I can't work. believe this. Please find attached my first ever piece of jewellery. All materials from Jewellery Maker. Kiss, kiss, Emma from Dudley. Emma, kiss, kiss back. Emma Rig from Dudley. You're amazing. If this is the start, where are you going to be in a year? Beautiful. Amazing. Absolutely. Well done. Yeah. Big well done to you. Fabulous. Beautiful. Good luck, Anne. You're and this 10. is a work of art, this. Look at the Labradorite. This that is, is so precise. If this 11, was Tony I really Hart's Wall of Fame, it would be, num it'd be the winner. It's beautiful, yeah. It's amazing. It's so... It's beautiful. This it's is number 11. Neat. Did you see how neat it, it was? It is so, so neat. And this is from... Uh, Karen. Karen Gray. Karen Gray. In Not York. Christian Gray. No, it's absolutely stunning, Karen. Um, hi all at JM. Here is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. I was lucky enough to be on last week, so thought I'd try for two in a row. Oh. This is the pen. Uh, this is the the variety of cabochons, the different gauges, and types of wire, plus seed beads and small labradorite heads. Um, and this was demonstrated by Laura. Laura Binding. Um, this is my first make from the kit and I've kept it quite simple using the 0.2 wire to do the wrapping as it is, gives such a delicate finish and is a joy to work with. Next time I'll try to use some of the other elements from the kit to be more adventurous. So much so much to choose from. There's a more danger adventurous. of overload. Can you get any more adventurous? Say exactly. Anyway, fingers crossed. I'm lucky this week and please keep up the brilliant shows. That is amazing. Wonderful. Absolutely amazing. I love it. She's the very luck. talented. Very, very. As is the lady that did this. Wow. Very, very. Is this, um, hang on. What is it? What kind of bird is it? Is it a kingfish or is it a hummingbird? Yeah, or is it the one from, um, what's it called on Game of Thrones? Not Game of Thrones. What's the thing where they I go? I think it is, yeah. Does it say on the back? Mockingjay. Is it a mockingjay? Yeah. I'll have a look. It'll tell us. Kingfisher. It's a kingfisher. Kingfisher, or yeah. a mocking I'm going to say it's a mockingjay. Uh, number 12. Uh, hi, all at Jewelry Maker. My entry for this week's Wall of Fame is a kingfisher. Inspired by Rachel Morris, isn't she wonderful? I love that woman so much. Oh, she's amazing. Oh, if she was a pudding, she'd be a banoffee pie. <laughs> I used a rose quartz, or actually, no, she wouldn't. She'd be an eaten mess. <laughs> I used a rose quartz, cabochon, amethyst, clear quartz, and quartzite, all wire and gemstones from Jewelry Maker. Good luck to all the entries to the Wall of Fame from Helen in Cornwall. Helen, That's love beautiful. that. Absolutely beautiful. Isn't it amazing? Wowzers. And it take you know this this these take time to do so mm. that's beautiful the wire work on there was gorgeous uh, this is number thirteen I love this pearls what a lovely My box favorite. as well it's lovely isn't it when it's displayed there we go oh and this is from Kay Kay in West Yorkshire um do we have Yorkshire accent then no did it sound it no, no it didn't do sound it. nothing I can't like, I'm not very good at everyone. accents no don't I'll Just, leave she's that probably to you. posh. <laughs> Hi everyone at JM, hope you're all fine and dandy. Here is my entry to the Wall of Fame. A pair of cultured pearl earrings and knotted necklace and knotted bracelet. They're all white cultured pearls with sterling silver crimps and clasp. This is my first attempt at knotting, which is not too bad. Wow. I think it's very good, it's excellent. I hope it is good enough for the wall. Good luck to all fellow Woffers and me, and love and best wishes to Carol and Vicky on their pitter patter of little feet. Aww. Thanks to you guys at JM, both in front of the camera and behind you are fab. Kind regards from Kay Hesling in West Yorkshire. Bless you, Kay. There are lots they of are, baby feet are, around yeah. at the moment, aren't there? I was saying earlier on, wasn't I? Carol was just too paracetamol. I can't believe it. I know, amazing, amazing. Amazing. It is amazing. Mm. Whew. <laughs> oh, can I had everything. Gasoline oh. <laughs> <laughs> tablets. Give it me all until I'm sick. Yes. <laughs> uh, look at this. I love this colour. I love the links. This is wonderful. I wonder if these are double um, drilled, are they? Yeah, they are, aren't they? Is it, they're is wonderful. It or? Is that polymer clay? Oh, it could be that it's they've been. Yeah, yeah, clay, yeah, it could be. I think. Yeah, it is. Yeah. This is from Christine in uh, North Wales. Christine says, that's a different Welsh accent to the one I'm doing. Uh, Hi to all, here is my latest contribution to, the, uh, to enter the Wall of Fame. I made the square-shaped beads from a polymer clay kaleidoscope cane, you were right, uh, in, exploring, in the Exploring Colour Workshop at Debbie. Last Tuesday, I made up the necklace when I got home. I used antique bronze wire and jump rings to connect all of the 10 millimetre pink round quartz beads to the square beads. Finished off with a round toggle clasp. Everyone is so friendly. It's great to do a workshop. I hope to do another one soon. Good luck to all and best wishes from Christine Eaton. Uh, Christine, this is wonderful. I love the colours. All amazing. 
and fabulous. isn't Debbie Bulford lush? If you're thinking, oh, I'd like to do that, then give us a tinkle, 0800 644 uh, Speak to Wendy and get yourself booked in on one of our wonderful courses. After the break, we have got Kim's favourite stand of the day. It is that caramel opal that's a producer. It makes you hungry. That is coming mm -hmm. up in an hour, so I am not straight up to me. Always for Starving. caramel. Always. I'm always hungry. And I am. I, really I can't have anything for the rest of the day, though, because I went through the drive through this morning on the way here. Oh, right. It made okay. me feel dirty. I won't lie to you. Uh, we are going to give you loads more information about Jewelry Maker, and we'll be back after the end of this. Download the Jewelry Maker app today. You can watch our Jewelry Maker shows live. View all the details of the item that is currently on air, as well as browsing all the items from today's show. You can also minimise the video or switch to use as a companion app. Get the Jewelry Maker app today and boost your viewing experience. You can now watch clips from Jewelry Maker on our YouTube channel. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. If you have a question or query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. Come and join Jewelry Maker on Facebook and get involved with over 50,000 people who have liked us. You'll get up-to-date information about our channel from the latest images of designs by our fantastic guests. Gossip on what is coming up in the shows and the newest information on our workshops. You can get in contact with jewellery makers all over the world and get some fantastic hints and tips. Simply search jewellery maker in the search box or go to facebook.com forward slash jewellery maker UK and you're there. You don't even need to have a Facebook account. We can't wait to see you there. Jewellery maker. Create. Wear. Share. You can now keep in touch by following jewellery maker on Twitter. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. We really appreciate your support here at Jewelry Maker. So we'd like to give you something back every time you refer a friend to us. Once your friend's order is delivered, you'll both be rewarded with a free £10 credit to each of your accounts. Simply log on to your account or ask our call centre team to find your refer a friend code, give it to your friend and have them type it into the refer box when they sign up online. Alternatively, give the code to our friendly call centre team and they'll do the rest. So come and bring your friends into the fabulous world of jewellery making. Jewellery Maker. Share your passion. When shopping with Jewelry Maker, you can add as many items to your order in one day and only pay one postage and packaging charge. We have two delivery options. Standard delivery at just £2.95 and you'll receive your parcel within four to six days. Or opt for our premium delivery at just £4.95 and you'll receive your parcel within three to four days. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. I love the fact that you get the chance to create jewellery with genuine precious gemstones such as ruby, emerald, sapphire. Yes, please. Have a look at these. They are lush. Absolutely gorgeous. Zambian emeralds. Look at the yellow sapphire. I love the yellow sapphires. Oh, this is such a special strand. You've also got beautiful deep blue sapphires in there as well. Look at that for an emerald. Oh, that one there. That looks Colombian, doesn't it? What would you do? Would you make a bracelet or would you individualize these? Would you just have one? Do you know what I would do? I'd have a pearl bracelet, all white pearls, and then one precious gemstone in the middle of, th of that. 
because then you think about it, you yeah. could you could charge one hundred and fifty pounds for that in the right place. Absolutely, couldn't you? Yeah, and, and you'd really get your money's worth then. Yeah, I love this. Which 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 would you choose out of all of those gorgeous? I think I, I don't think it matters. I think the one right in the middle. Well, the one right in the middle yeah. with big pearls, and then maybe I'd yeah. make a smaller pearl bracelet with sm yeah. and, and just do a variation yes. of all different ones. To yeah. be honest, maybe you could make a matching necklace and have the one in the middle of it as well. I love that. I don't love pearls and precious gems. So they just emeralds work. and sapphires to take to a craft fair, or I mean, or some some craft fairs that um, have at the um, stately homes, which are good to do. They're a little bit more expensive. Yeah, but, but they're the ones that you want to go to on a day trip. They're the ones that will probably, yeah, yeah. They're the ones I the go sofa. to, taking the kids out for the day, go somewhere nice, get to look at the uh, surroundings. Have I used to go to the one in... Um, and then, in, yeah, go around. I forgot what I was going to say, hang on. In? Sudley Castle, Sudley in Winchcombe. Yes. Expensive, but we, you'd always go there to buy something. Exactly. Now, I think if you're going to create jewellery with that strand that's what you need yeah that kind of jewelry kind they're of the kind of places that you yeah. want you need to go to sell it ATV X46 you've got 90 carats of precious gemstones have you ever seen the sapphire so big in the center thanks Amelia love you we're going to give you the most amazing spotlight deal price tag with a 30 day money back guarantee get it while you can Your spotlight deal price today. They do look nice together, mind. It's only £40 for this strand. Just get it. £39.95. pence. What else could you get? Do you know, you'd spend that on a dress, wouldn't you? You'd spend that on a pair of shoes. These are forever, forever gemstones. And believe me, you can create the most gorgeous pieces of jewellery to go with the dresses, the outfits that you've bought. And for under £40, pounds, you've got something incredible. ATV X46 is your item code, 90 carats together, an 18 centimetre strand, utterly, utterly gorgeous. Matches my dress, Ali Defoy, that those lovely girls sent to me from uh, Want That Trend. I will, t I will ask them for you, Lady Defoy. I love that butterfly dress too, I love it too. Me and Ali Defoy um, are loving that website at the moment, we need to tell you. Have a look on my um, presenter page. We're loving, I'm loving them. Oh, you look gorgeous in that dress, very classy. Tell she's in love. 39, I wind her up every day. 39 pounds and 95 pence, ATV X 46. Oh, Philip, look at you in that shirt. I love that. You can tell he's in love, can't you? Kim says she's not against the idea of marriage anymore, just so you know. <laughs> and I'm definitely being the bridesmaid. Me and Ali Defoy will look good next to you as bridesmaids, don't you think? I'm a good bridesmaid at the dress. Hang on a minute. How many times have you been a bridesmaid? Oh, you're all right then. Three times a bridesmaid, never a bride. That's what they say. So you're alright, you've still got one more window. <laughs> one more window before it's your turn. Okay. Panic over everyone. Now, what are you saying, Kim? I'm gonna call them nougars rather than nuggets. I don't I, I'm actually against the word nugget. It's there's nothing Nougar, yeah, that's uh, good. Nuggets. Nuggets. Or something a bit classier sounding than nugget. That sort of sounds like a nougat, doesn't it? Nougat bar. I do love nougat. Do you? I don't like the word nugget. It's like when, um, what's her name who's married to what's his face? <laughs> oh, you know I'm old when I say that, don't you? What's his name? Uh, I mean, um, what's his name? He was a model and he has hair like that and he goes out with the girl who does Strictly. What's the girl called with the blonde hair that does Strictly? She's an, a northern lass. Vernon Kay, what's his wife called? Castelli. She does a voiceover for a yoghurt commercial and she goes, yoghurt, and it really annoys me. I'm like, yoghurt, yoghurt. It's a really sensual yoghurt. <laughs> like, oh, I hate the way she says it. I would say yoghurt. You say yoghurt. 
Yogurt. Yogurt. Is that what they say? Like Americans. No, yogurt. A yogurt. A yogurt. I, I prefer the way that um, you say yogurt. Yeah, yogurt isn't that a good word, is it? Like nugget isn't. Nugget. Yogurt. Yeah, yogurt. <laughs> Mikey just said, let's have a look at your nuggets. <laughs> All right, Mikey, calm down, lad. It's only quarter past 11. Now. <laughs> I showed you this with the tanzanite earlier. I think it would look gorgeous with the topaz. I mean, I'm a bit of a lover of the red and the blue at the moment. Look at that deep, wonderful colour. And I would always put it with gold. I would definitely put it with pearls. Look at the texture. Now, a big thing for me at the moment, a, a big interest is in beaded kumahimo. I love it something that I really enjoy wearing and actually I can do Kumahimo now. It's only taken me how many years have I been here? Years. How many years have you been a producer Kim? So I've been here about six years then. I love to crochet the nuggets as well. Or new, new Crocheting Sorry. them looks amazing. Amazing. In fact, I, need, I don't know whether I've got it in my bag. I, I nearly put one on this morning but I was a bit rushed. So um, yeah it, and I did a white one with white nuggets and I love it, it with that blue. It does look gorgeous crocheted, yeah. And you knitted. And, and knitted. And they did. Yeah, and knitted. And knitted. Mm. I thought you said, yeah. and they did. And, and I was knitted. like, and they did what? <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, uh, that was the yeah. end of that. End of what? Knitting, crocheting. You can add these to a beady bead. You can use these for beady kumihime. You can surround a cabochon with gorgeous nuggets. Nougat. Nougat. Maybe that's how I should say it. <laughs> Kim's going to phone Scott. Don't forget to text us in. What words don't you think sound pretty? What's not a pretty word, Wesley? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> Think of a not pretty word. Um, Hang on, I've got, I had one the other day. Oh, like garter. That's not a pretty word. Guitar. Guitar. Oh, guitar. 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 Yeah, no, guitar. that's not, yeah. That's yeah. not yeah. nice, is it? Yeah, no, that, uh, yeah, no, that's another one. <laughs> Ali loves the word marshmallow, though, and I love bubble. I love marshmallow oh, and oh. drinking chocolate. I love the marshmallow that you can spread on toast in drinking chocolate. Oh, I do like the fluff alley. Yeah, I love it. I love the fluff. Have you ever had a Have you ever had a sandwich that you've made out of wafers or with the fluff in? Oh yeah. <laughs> you have a sweet tooth, then, Jenny. I used to have a savoury tooth, but now yes, on ice cream it would be perfect. But now I'm all about the banoffee pies and all about that. You know, I'm, I'm a, I love I love food actually. And I do. For these nuggets, nuggets. Fourteen pounds and ninety-five pence. They're ruby. They're gorgeous ruby. I'm gonna call. Them, I, I think they're kind of like chips, rather little chips of, of they ruby. They are. Yeah. Yeah. They are. Definitely. They're not nuggets, are they? I, I imagine nuggets. I'm gonna banish the word nugget. Yeah. If I was the queen of hearts. And potato. Potato. Yeah, on pearls. As in pearls. No. Shouldn't be called potato. No. Pearls. Delphin was at the very least. <laughs> These <laughs> delphin was pearls. <laughs> <laughs> Eleven ninety five for Ruby, Jewelry Maker in Devon, Susie in Lincolnshire, Tony in Cornwall, Jacqueline, you've all got yours, these are as gorgeous as you. What are you going to do with them? I'm, I'm definitely steering towards the road of Kumahimo. Oh, 806 I wish I lived on Kumahimo Lane, but I don't. Now, I'm going to give to you some choir. What's this? Findings forms. So it's to make shepherd's hooks, is it, Kim? It's a jig to make shepherdy hooks. What does this little doujois do then? Yes, but what's this bit here for at the end? I don't. Oh, it's to go on that bit. Is it? I don't know. So this is an e I've never seen this before. The instructions are included and you can make 
a consistently formed finding every time. That's the pro promise on the back. And it's a, it's a jig, so you use your um, wire to go around. So, and, and the great benefit of this, of course, is that every single finding will be exactly the same. Exactly the same. Now, I'm also going to give you 0 0.8 wire with this. Now, 0 0.8 wire, would you use 0 0.8 for in conjunction with this, or would you go with a 0 0.6? I think, uh, I, yes, you can. You, you can use 0 0.6. You can, to make, a, to make a shepherd's hook. Well, I suppose it depends how big the hole is in your in your really, piercing, really. yeah. But, I mean, these are, the ones I've got in are, would be clustered as 0 0.8, yeah. Oh, so they're, 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 they're quite, fine. They're quite, yeah. They're quite, yeah. I'm sure I've got a thick gauge through my piercing you before, look, look. yeah. I mean, if you, if you look at, do you want to, if you look at that close, that's definitely, or if you put it next to the wire, look. Oh, gosh, I'd even so say it could be I'll close to a one millimetre, you know. And I think it's, yeah, it might be it. And that's so one of our, yes, okay, that's, so these that's one findings are about 0 0.8. Thank yeah. you, my darling. Yeah, there you go. Don't give me anything that I might lose. Mm -hmm. uh, so you've got two reels of wire, and you've got the jig as well. We're going to give you a grand price tag on this one. QBG C42 is your item code. All yours. For $9.95. A t is, is it, though? You just said, is it, though? Make sure Philip teaches your children how to speak. Seven pounds. You'd pay that for the jig alone. In fact, can you get wire for that price tag anywhere else but here at Jewelry Maker? I'd argue that you can't. You have got the eight millimeter wires, two reels of that, and you've got a jig. And the jig is—is is it a beadsmith piece? I mean, they're, so, they're such good value, you know, Jenny. I mean, to, to pay elsewhere for that, you wouldn't if, pay it for this jig. You, would you? All of that would probably cost you three times as much. Great Honestly. value. And the thing is, it, it means that you're going to be able to fire out consistent pieces. They're going to look neat. They're going to look more professional mm. because they're going to be so precise. And that's what we're looking for in jewelry that we're selling, isn't it? We're looking for that precision. We're looking for that ultimate finish where it's neat and it's tidy. And it looks more like jewelers than homemade jewelry. I, I, would you agree? £7.95. Incredible price tag with a 30 day money back guarantee on absolutely everything that you buy from us here at JM. Use your debit card or your credit card if you're shopping with us here today at Jewelry Maker. It is luscious to have you all on board. Oh, we got text messages coming through. She's tight with these text messages, our Kim. Uh, Debbie of West Yorkshire says, Morning, ladies. Jenny, this is a fabulous tool. Perfect for earrings every time. Do you know what? I'm, I'm loving this. And it's give, here's the actual size. Thanks so much, Debbie. Here's the actual size of the earring finding that you can create. It's a nice big piece. And you know what? You can use these for findings as well. They can be clasps and connectors, can't they? You want to go for some Laramar? I do too. Let's take ourselves, my lovely jewelry makers, to a tropical island. Ooh. Close your eyes. Oh yes. Let's go to the Dominican Republic, shall we? Shall we? Let's. Let's go. Claire's been to the Dominican Republic, haven't you, Claire? Was it beautiful? Would you go back? Yes. I always think that's the mark of a place when you think, mm. I want to go back, I didn't have time enough there. Was it, ex was, was it expensive anyway out there? Like when you go to Thailand, it's so cheap, you think, oh my gosh, is, is it expensive in the Dominican Republic? Claire saw little tiny pieces of this and it was super expensive. Well, of course, this is a gemstone exclusive to the Dominican Republic. Laramar is only found in the Dominican Republic. Look at that colour. It's stunning. Laramar. What a tropical breeze of a colour. Think about this. I love that colour. With your topaz. Oh, I oh, love it. Oh, gosh, look at that. That's a perfect match, isn't it? Stunning. Why don't we all go and live somewhere tropical? I mean, like, it's so beautiful. Why are we? That I do be... love living in England, actually. Let's not. I, no. I do. No. But isn't it lovely to go and visit these places of such incredible beauty? I love it. 
look at this for colour. I think if you've never travelled before, you've got to. I think that really combination is such a it's such a head turner. If you were wearing that, I mean, uh, my eyes would follow follow I the jewellery it. because it's absolutely gorgeous. It really, really is. I just think it doesn't matter what skin tone you've got. I think it doesn't matter what what um, kind of season it is because in the in the winter these are icy blues but in the summer it's, my it's god it's just so peaceful isn't it as well and, and it just shouts out holidays to you the birds in the trees in yes. even when i went to australia Peacocks. the other week I, was like, I said to my friend is that a parrot in the tree she's like oh it's a it's like a cockatiel but yeah. it's not so all these amazing colors the feathers were amazing i just couldn't believe mm. it aren't birds beautiful they are and Gosh, they are actually like that. oh do you know what i saw this morning which was really i meant to say what, what? talking about birds and ducks i was going up warwick high street and it was very quiet obviously at seven o'clock in the morning and i just i just noticed something walking on the pavement and it was a mummy duck oh! with about eight little little ducks and they were it. all sort of waddling up the street and it was so cute i was like oh and there was nobody love about it. nobody had yeah, and, these, and I thought, I've never seen that before, ever, going up a high street. They must have got lost from the river. It's the time. Oh. They usually have two lots. Remember, they, they did it just... on my roof before. Yeah. And the mother was an awful mother. She didn't look after them at all. Oh, no, they all this got one was so proud, you know, for oh, the little ducks. Oh, I love the it. baby ducks following. <laughs> yeah, and they were all in line. And You I watch them herons with those ducks, mind. They're horrible. They gobble them up. Oh, don't. It's awful. Awful. Don't. Oh, I they love, so isn't it a lovely day. sight. The oh, it was side. really. We it love was. ducks, Kim. Oh, there was just so. It's yeah, not the it duck was, show. That's what Kim's saying. It's not the duck show. It's just a little story. All right. We do enjoy a story, me and Sheila. Thank you. Michelle in County Durham says that centerpiece is in a ring. Yeah, I reckon. Let me try that. Hang on. Let me give give you some labradorescence together. Look at that, isn't it lush? Right, let's try that centre one as a ring. Definitely. Look at that for a colour, I love it. Isn't it lovely? Should be £34.95. Wouldn't this make a gorgeous necklace as well, jewellery makers? Let's try that. Oh, I love colour. We've got to stop wearing black, haven't we? Isn't that lovely? I love it. £24.95 is your price tag. EUR U58, £24.95. Incredible colour. What about with your Tanzanite rounds? I love this amazing blue it's like a treasure chest of gorgeous blues it's going to go with pearls absolutely put it with the pearls oh, i love that loads of you there we've got another tanzanite cabochon coming i'm sorry to shout i got a bit excited an oval where is it oh i love this an oval Tanzanite cabochon. Oh, I could really, she I could really be on a beach right now, could you? Oh, yes, I've been thinking about that since you mentioned When is your beach holiday then? Um, I don't know, be later on in the year. I'm going to Brighton <gasps> for three days with my granddaughter. So I love Brighton. Yeah. Which granddaughter? Uh -huh. Jessie. Just you and Jessie? Yeah, just me and Jessie. Yeah. How lovely. Well, she's, she's been reading a book about an author that lives there. So she wanted to go. I wanted to go to Brighton for ages and ages. And go down the lanes and we've got a lovely hotel right on the, the front you've been here before have you no I, well i did many 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 years ago i so love I'm really it. looking forward to, to my, as uh, my mum would always tell me about brighton she used to live there my brother and sister were born in brighton she was there at brighton beach with the mods and the rockers oh yes yes you have to watch quadrophenia they're doing a stage production of it aren't they Are now they? yeah oh so yeah, no, I'm, I'm not going on any sunny holidays till later on. Now, you're going to love it though, it's so pretty. All the cobbled streets, gorgeous. Have a look at this. I'm bringing you an oval cabochon of Tanzanite. What a colour again, love this. 
Let me shine some light through it to show you the inner pinks. And you can see them, can't you? So Tanslite is a pleochroic gemstone, or a trichroic gemstone, which means that you don't, it, it delivers more than one colour. When the light travels in, you get the most amazing refraction back, and it just goes bong, 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 all these incredible colours. But you've got, you know, the, it's, it's really wonderful because when you're wearing it in a ring, you'll be somewhere and light will travel from a, dis a, a place there where it wasn't earlier and you'll get a flash. And it's just a, a gemstone that you want to watch and you want to look at and that you'll never get bored of. Because we can wear jewellery sometimes, you think, oh, I'm, I'm over that now, I've worn it to death. But Tanzanite isn't that kind of gemstone. Tanzanite is a gemstone that I think delivers every single day something new, something exciting. You're getting this lush colour. Definitely put it with pearls. Definitely put it in a brooch, but totally bridal. Already seeing lots of you seeping through on the phone lines. Now, there is a bit of a queue, a bit of a wait on our phone lines, but please don't be disheartened because it is a free phone number if you're dialing from a UK landline. 0800 644 655 is the number to be calling. 10 carats in your tans, like 10 by 14 millimetres. YVP 042 is your item code. These are just £39.95 pence incredible 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 value you've got a 30-day money-back guarantee under 40 pounds for real times like get this have it valued if you wish what are you going to do with yours in the center of a necklace prong set in a ring prong set into a pendant prong set into some uh, post and butterfly back earrings maybe you're going to suit ash with these maybe you're going to chain mail with these what do you do sheila um i would probably use some of our materials that we have now because they look lovely ruched at the back and then encasing it with some gemstones. Mm. Well, that's, maybe that's some another way. Lace or yes, lace. Yeah, yeah. So that's, that's another way. They are very. You can use them in any way, really. You can wire wrap them. You can just use them as sutash, as you said. So don't don't look and think. Oh, I can only do one thing with that. You can't. You can oh, just, so you many just have to Think a little bit and and try something a little bit different. I agree absolutely wholeheartedly. YVP 042 10 carats. Thirty-nine pounds and ninety-five pence. West has got no beard. Is that what's different? That was driving me mad. I thought I've just called him Wesley, and that's not Wesley. Is it? What has he got rid of? The, did he have a bigger beard or something? Borderline Santa. It's, I didn't know. I hate getting people's names wrong. I can't stand that. £39.95. YVP042 is your item code. 10 carats. And these are 10 by 14 millimetres. Now, it's time for our next kit. Do you know it's Hickstead next week? I'm very excited. Just thought I'd put that out there. Hickstead. Now. Oh, look at the connectors again. I love these. I'm going to start with those connectors. The pearls are amazing, by the way. But I'm going to start with these connectors. I want to show you. So you have got a lovely connector. It's almost a bit of a bow in shape. And then you've got the two drill holes at the end. Now we're going to see how Sheila's used these but these can be used in a weave to create uniform in a pearl necklace, something very simple to keep those rows together. Have you ever made a two row, row pearl necklace and just sort of wished you could keep that uniform throughout? Maybe they get twisted sometimes. It's a perfect way of doing that. Now you're going to get ten of these and they are sterling silver. I love this kind of finding. It's so useful. Now have a look at this. You've got a flower finding here. But what I want you to see is that you've got a little spike, which I'm holding on to there. Now you can use this to your advantage by loading it up with gemstones. You can put something on there, perhaps polymer clay, and use it for a bit of leverage. And I want you to see around the back, you have got two bales here and here. And this is solid stirring silver, and there is a lot of silver on here. You could use it as a ring finding. You can use it as a pendant finding. We'll see what Sheila's done with it in a sec. Now look at these gemstones. 
You've got some real buttes. They're all birth gemstones. Are these pearls, the peacocks? White pearls, white pearls. Super duper dear. Oh, it's ra rainbow shell. Yes, rainbow shell pearl. They look very much like uh, natural peacock pearls, don't they? Look at this colour. Of course, the benefit with a shell pearl, you're going to get that perfection in around every single time. But there's nothing quite wo like wearing a real pearl, is there? And I'm going to give you two strands. They're both different, and I'll show you for why. Because the drill hole is in a different place. They look like a different shape, but they're not the same shape. So the drill hole sits in these ones uh, through the side of the pearl, giving you a different look. And then through the top of the pearl, in this instance, giving you a rice pearl. So in these, you've got them sat side by side, which makes them lovely in bracelets. It makes them look gorgeous in rings. It makes them look gorgeous using them in tiaras and fascinators or as a center piece. Here, perfect for drop earrings, perfect for clusters. Now you're also gonna get a double strand of amethyst. So you've got June's birth gemstone here and you've of course got February's birth gemstone in the amethyst. Amethyst is such a classic gemstone. It's one that we all know about and look how the textures just work so well together. If I intertwine these, the textures work beautifully and the colors are divine together, aren't they? Don't forget that you also had those 10 connectors, something I've never seen before. And we got a text about those very connectors. Uh, Brenda from Essex says, connectors, I went like that, sorry. Uh, connectors make a great double ring. Yeah, that's exactly what I want them for, exactly. I'd love to see an example of that because I get excited about those. Do you remember when we used to do the ones that looked like um, Kids Meccano? And I used to, I love them. But you do, I haven't seen them for ages. Yeah, they were like, um, it's really hard to explain, like that shape. They had three holes in them, like Meccano, but little, amazing for keeping them. Um, you, you can remember them, can't you? Maybe it's because I was obsessed with them. Look, aren't they pretty? And the whole point of these is to keep uniform in your jewellery or use them as like a, a, a bit of a joint in between hinges. So you'd put, you do remember them, yeah? Good, thank you. What? Um, I've got this thing, I hate losing my memory, and I can't remember the name of one of my friend's dogs, and it's driving me pots. I'm going to have to ring her later, because I thought about it the other day, I was like, what's the dog called? Dri driving me mad. I, I've been thinking about it non-stop, and I think, am I getting old? Is there something wrong with me? Am I, I had a bash to the head the other day, I was in the shed and something fell down and whacked me on the head, and now I've lost my memory. Don't is that we, what it is? Yeah, we haven't worried about it. No, 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 you're all right. I am paranoid that I'm going to die all the time, though. Uh, now, we've got a text from <laughs> Michelle, because I so don't want to. Oh, no, but I'm like, it's going to happen. Do you get that? I do. Oh, yeah, and I'm a lot older than you, so well, yeah, I, I do. can't bear the thought of it. No, I know. Uh, if anyone says, oh, she she didn't know she was dying, she'd have been fine. I wouldn't. I, would have, I, would, I don't want to die. So if, if I die in a plane crash or something, I'd be like, she wouldn't have known. I would have, and I would have hated it. So don't think that I went down without a fight. Uh, I would use the connectors as a feature in it. Yeah, uh, do you know what? Good idea, because they could... Yeah, I have, yeah, I have, yeah. I've it is a random that. thing to say, but I t say it to my children all the time. If you sat there ever at my funeral, and they were like, she went in peace. I didn't. If I knew I was dying, it w I was not going in peace. No one can be happy about that. that. No. I'm not, I'm not ready for any of that. Are you? No. no. Still looking for that youth serum. We are lasting well, a bit longer Well, it's time's running days. out for me now. It's not. <laughs> what, are you talking about? what are you talking about? You have only, not even lived half your life yet. I have. You have not. I have. No. Yes, you, know, you know I have. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to argue with that because people are living till 100, like 100 and something now. Yeah, well, I, I'm well over, well over half, aren't I? No. Thank I'm you. not having it, I'm afraid. You're not I don't feel as though I am, but, you know, you just, yeah. As you say, that cream hasn't been invented yet. It will. <laughs> it will in our youth. I hope it does quick. Quick, suck the youth out of Mateo. Yeah. <laughs> You'd think with all the technology that they have, they could do something like oh, that. Oh, they no. can. They can freeze us. They just don't want to. There's no storage space. <laughs> £29.95. pence. do not tell me... Don't tell me they can't freeze people and bring them back to life. They can do it with, you know what, swimmers. 
Uh, £29.95 RTG. And they're alive. I told you about that, didn't I? Never go to America and say that you're going swimming and tell them that you're going to put your swimmers on because it means something different in America that it doesn't mean in the UK. Don't ever say, I'm just going to go and pop and get me swimmers. Because they'll look at you funny. I know, I've been there. 29, they call it a bathing suit. 29, they call something else swimmers. 29.95. What, you call them swimmers? I do. Let's get your swimmers on. Do you call them your swimmers, Mateo? Well, it must be an older generation thing, do you? No. What, cosy swimmers? Yeah, something like that, yeah. No, not swimmers, no. £29.95, just me then. £29.95, only 106, triple four, six, double five, under £30 for a gorgeous kit. Let's go on over to that luscious lady. Have a look at all the wonderful designs. That. Don't forget the findings. Goodness me, don't forget those. Now, my luscious one. And you did. Oh, you've used them in a, in a bracelet. I've used them that. in a bracelet and the earrings. How yeah. wonderful. Yeah. Let's have a look. So many different ideas, I think, go around your head. And when you see what somebody else has done, you're like, I didn't even, that wasn't even on my list. I love this. So very simple, very elegant, love. And looks really, really, really professional because of those findings. They are lovely. They really are lovely, the findings. And they're different as well. I mean, I, I, I was going to do it all pearl, and then I just changed my mind, as you do. Oh, but well, yeah, I've, yeah. I've, I've also got a, a couple left as well, so. I'm loving these earrings, by the way, here. I might have to put those in my ear today. Aren't they you, lovely? You always go with them, and then they never I don't know about. what you're saying. No. Of course I don't. No. Claire, quickly take a photograph of these, please. <laughs> But no, that she's that taking a grab. It will go on the. Is, is that okay? what she's doing? Yeah. Okay. Okay. She's taking a grab. Why can't you put that on Facebook? Take a picture of it off your phone. Come on. Oh, I've got earrings in already. Yeah. Oh, I just I've disappointed myself. What a shame. I'm really annoyed. <laughs> <laughs> I always think it's a compliment if I want to. Oh, absolutely, wear it. absolutely. I love earrings. I just lose one all the time. I love the beady bead that you've done in the centre here. This is very regal. So pretty. It, it, I mean, I think, you know, sometimes simplicity. So this is a very, very elegant, as I would say. It's a, a more of an elegant look. The elegant collection. The elegant, yeah. yeah. It's not just any yeah. collection. I love this. So a bit of asymmetry going mm. on. A bit of lots of different bits and bobs in there, just showing the different techniques. Which I really like. And you've got that toggle clasp, but actually you could make a feature of that. We were talking about that earlier, yes, weren't we? Yes, yes, you could. You love could this. Now Very that, classic. Well, that you could have just as a, a long lariat, because that's, that's gone round three it times. Unravels, it, it? Un it unravels, does it? It unravels. It's just one, one long piece. So you can have it like that, or you could have it as a simple lariat coming down the front and if you've got any gemstones left then just make a bit of a toggle like a, an elasticated ring of, of whatever gemstone you want and then tie it round and you've got like a toggle effect. Oh I love that idea. Mm. So that's It's uh, nice to have versatility in, in yeah. your pieces. It's, have a look at this. It's like <gasps> three pieces really it can be. I love this finding it's super pretty have a look. Isn't this gorgeous? Oh, I love that. It's so, so pretty, mm, isn't it? It's really, so, so pretty. really pretty. Let's centralise it. So I love when pretty. you do, like, that little droopy bit there. Very downton. Yeah, and it's, it is. It's lovely. I really, really love that. Took a shine to that. I'm a big fan of that, too. Now, you're going to give us a demo. Yeah, a demo, quick demo. Um, I mean, this is just some of the section on the, the, the necklace on the, the left there. That's got, that's, you start off with three strands of your beading thread. Take it away, Take my it love. away. Take it away. Okay. So as you can see on here, I've got three three lengths of beading thread, okay? Mm -hmm. And then just put your crimp bead in the top, fold it over, ready for your necklace clasp, and pop on your uh, crimp bead. And then you just use these three strands. So you can use it in any way you've want, you want. Try and keep them um, in the right order so that they don't get tangled and maybe cause a bit more of a twist and then all I've done is I put a pearl on the one side and some of the little amethyst nuggets and then some of the um, pematite and then and then just done some different ones in the middle different ones on the outside but always put it through because you need a bigger hole to put the three strands through always put it through a bigger hold 
gemstone, which these these are these. Another are quite, benefit of having a shell pearl yes, as a drill hole. Yes, figure. exactly. Yes, the shell pearls. Sorry, what did I say? Mm -hmm. You probably said, uh, yeah. They, I can, they I do look a bit. Well, actually, I've got a real peacock pearls. They do look they a bit. really good, yeah. aren't they? But no, they are. Oh, yeah, those. peacock pearls. Um, so I've got the, the peacock pearls going in between because they have got a bigger hole. So I mean, you can do it any way you want. As and as I've done, I've done a section there, and then I've put the peacock pearl through all three. Um, I put all the three strands through the peacock pearl. Then I've put pearls. I put two either side and a pearl in the middle, back through the peacock pearl, and it then gives you this different. You've got three layers of of the thread, but giving a different look each time you put different. You know, you can put some of the peacock pearls all on if you want to, and then just bunch it up again. The the pearls. Two strands will go through the pearls but um, not three. So um, the hole in these peacock pearls are more generous. But just sort them out just to make sure, because with a pearl, as you know, there gets lots of dust in there, doesn't there? So you do have to um, sort them out, mm -hmm. which, and because it's black, hang on, there we go, there's the hole. There okay, we go. I there can help go. you if not. Because it looks, it's quite a dark colour. Sometimes I, get, I just, <laughs> yeah, I do that. Sharp yeah, blows yeah. through yeah. there. I'll be blowing their ears out then weren't I in mm -hmm. the gallery and then just and then just do really what you want however you want it to be you know you can put two on in the middle three either side and then just take it through another piece and always bunch it up because it, it gives you that cluster effect whoops so really that's all you do just build up your different um, sections with the different gemstones and then just push them together I haven't done that one yet, so I'll do some on the other side. So if I put three on the other side and then just scrunch it up together, it'll give you another cluster, but in just different. So it's it's quite it's quite random, really, mm -hmm. but it, it just gives you a, a different look, doesn't it, really? I think so. I love um, it. It's, I love it's it. just something a little bit different, especially if oh, you... It's elegant, and it's... it's yeah, like you said, it's delicate, it's elegant. Well, and, it's if, and if you're new to jewellery making and you haven't experimented with any of the threads as such, you know, you've just kept it to stranding um, one strand, then this is another way of doing something. So if you just push those up together, pop on another one with a larger hole, well, a clearer hole. There we go, that looks... So always check them out first just to make sure that they all will go through. So hopefully this one will go through as well. There you go. And then just push that up. And then it gives you another little clustered look. Super pretty. And then just carry on again, just doing the different sections. So that that that, that really is a, you know, it's yeah, it's quite pretty. And and, and, and the know, use of the thread as well. When something flows like that, you sort of do it and you don't realise after like a couple of minutes you've what well, no. feels like two minutes yeah. has been yeah. half an hour. It's such a yeah. nice thing to do because it's it flows. You can use your imagination and I, it's not stressful. I do think jewellery making is very therapeutic anyway. Yeah, I do you too. Know, it is. Yeah. It's, it's, it, especially if you've had a lot of stress or worries, or it's a good way of bringing yourself out of that zone and into a more calmer. I agree. Calmer it's hard zone. to stop <coughs> thinking about things that it worry is, you. It is absolutely yeah, and it's it's just a very pretty, pretty kit. It very, is very, it's very, pretty, very, pretty, pretty, very feminine. feminine. Yeah, mm. very feminine. Thank you so much, Sheila. We're going to go back on over and uh, give you another labradorite deal, and I'll see you. Okay. I'll meet you at the wharf. At the wharf. I'll meet yeah. you at the wharf. Uh, we got loads of texts in uh, today. We will read some more out in a sec. Now, what am I doing? Updating. I I don't know what I've done with it. What did I do with it? Hmm. Where have you gone, labradorite? I had it a minute ago because I put it next to another gemstone. There's one over here, Jenny, that was earlier on. No, not the, not is it the cabochon we're doing? No. No. Oh, no. Amelia took it. Because you were being efficient. I was. No. Oh, I need to let you know that it does look like it's going to sell out, but we've got more unchecked baskets than we've got stock but that doesn't mean that you could come through quickly check out a basket and steal it out of somebody else's that would be dastardly wouldn't it but it can be done 4.95 was the insanest price tag i've ever done on jewelry maker for labradorite for anything and nothing should be 4.95 really what can you buy for 4.95 if you had a fiver in your pocket and it was your last fiver you wouldn't get much for it would you 
Yeah, magazines are even more expensive now if they've got a gift on them, though, aren't they? Look at that. Look at that colour. What can you buy? Not a lot. A couple of bags of crisps. A what? Something from the, market. Something from the drive through maybe. Yeah, but you feel dirty afterwards. Four, I do. I had a bagel this morning from there. Feel awful. Cheese and sausage. I shouldn't have eaten it. But it was so good. I was so hungry. There were no oats in the car. Four pounds and 95 pence. YTC123. Incredible price tag. You have to check your basket out for that. It's the most ridiculous price tag ever. Scott's done something special on the Tanzanite Oval. We gave it to you at 39.95 and Scott came in and changed it. It might not change on your graphics, but it will. Oh, it, it will, apparently. Oh. It's now 20, ignore that, it's now 29 pounds and 95 pence. If you go on the website, it will be 29.95. If you call through, it will be 29.95. Our system does not want us to do it because it's saying we're not making enough money at all on that. It's, it would be ridiculous. This is genuine Tanzanite. Now that price tag on your screen is wrong. Scott took it down on the system. It's now 29.95. It was Scott who did something crazy. We didn't know about it earlier, and uh, we need you to know now it's only £30, not £39.95. Uh, it is definitely £29.95. It is not £39.95. We just can't change it on our graphics. If you ring in, it will be £29.95. If you do it on the web, your total price tag will be £29.95. Ignore that. It's not right. £29.95, not the price tag that's on your screen. You do need to make sure you are checking out your baskets. Emery in Cumbria, you've done it. Uh, Jewelry Maker in Devon, Belinda in Buckinghamshire's now got two. Uh, Stella in Somerset's got three. YVP 042, let's see if this works. It, oh, it's £29.95. Uh, We're going to put the price at the bottom of the screen for you. There you go. You have to, you know, you've got to. Up here for thinking, Kim, isn't it? My little brummy in a box. Twenty nine ninety five. Over half of the stock has already gone, of course. At thirty nine ninety five. At twenty nine ninety five, you're getting a, a beautiful pure tanzanite cabochon. Look at that colour. That deep blue that you want in a cab. It's a bit special, isn't it? Look at that stock flying out now. Uh, Annette uh, in Gwent. Dalvir in Greater London Town, Margaret of Fife, Annie, Seb, Andrea, uh, Madeleine, Janet, Isabel, Jane, you've all got to check out baskets, more of you as well, loads of anonymous uh, jewellery makers. Jilly, you've got yours? I've just started a Jilly Cooper I've never read. Made me very happy yesterday. 50 chances, that's how you know you're old, Claire, you see when you get excited by discovering that you've not read a Jilly Cooper book. Jewelry maker in Cheshire, Maxine uh, in Tennessee. Hello, Antoinette. How are you, my love? Antoinette, you've got yours at Belfast. Uh, loads of you there. Elizabeth's got three. Eliz where is Swytopelk in Cleveland? Where's that? Swytopelk. Where's Cleveland? Is it Scotland? You don't even know. It's America. Is it America? Did I make that up? I don't know. Malcolm David in Cheshire, that's a very posh name, I love it. Uh, Maxine, uh, because of your name, you've given me that, uh, do you remember that song about Maxine? Did I tell you about a girl, her name is Maxine, murder she wrote. Do you remember that? Years ago, no, you're too young. Never mind. Jewelry makers, these lot are so young, they don't even remember Emu or Orville. They don't. They don't know anything about the raggy dolls. Fraggles, Muppets, nothing. Now I've got the night, look at this, luscious colour. Have they gone and sold air near them tans nice? This is very oriental to me, have a look. Do you know what it reminds me of? You know, oh, and this is funny because did you see the guy from McFly who had his baby and he was blowing, um, what's it called, a dandelion with at the time, I used to call them clocks. They're like fluffy dandelions and you go, one o'clock, two o'clock, do you know what I mean? 
Yeah, they do not. I mean, do you see the guy on Busted or McFly who was doing it and his son was in hysterics every time he did it? It's the funniest, cutest thing. And have a look. Reminds me of one here. A summer sky when you're lying in... Oh, I love this. I miss this so much. When I used to live at my mum's house when I was like a teenager, lying in the back garden, my mum would bring me a Pims. I probably was the age that I should be. Uh, I'd be reading one of her Jilly Coopers, quite inappropriately, in a bikini, before you had the body, you know, before you had kids. Ah, oh, not a care in the world. No bills, nothing. Do you remember that? best time of our lives, wasn't it? That's what this reminds me of, it's that sky blue. That not a care in the world blue. Do you remember not a care in the world? You don't remember it. Did you not ever have that, Kim? You did not a care in the world times. When you're a teenager and you didn't have to pay for anything and you went into work and your mum didn't make you pay rent, you just got to spend your money on exactly what you wanted to. That's what you're still doing now, isn't it? You don't know you're born, you kid. Look at that. Isn't it wonderful? Isn't it gorgeous? I love this. Those look like little uh, juts of when the when the what's it called when the aeroplane makes a trail? Yes, I know what you mean. Yeah. What's it called, Kim? It almost looks like a cloud there as well. You know, they've got all those different. Yes, it is beautiful. a cloud. Like a cloud isn't it? What a beautiful sky scene here. Actually, it looks like the ocean with, with sort of ships going, you know, have the <gasps> trail of the boats yes, where they make. Yes, of course it does. Yes. They make the trail. Oh, what are they going towards? Oh. What's that triangle, the Bermuda Triangle? No, hopefully not <laughs> no. that. Is that a real thing, the Bermuda Triangle? You get yeah. sucked in. Well, they, I mean, no. I wonder I where it goes. No one wants to find out, do they? Maybe they just spin around and then they forget where they're going, so they could end up anywhere, couldn't they? I don't know really, but I mean, there has been lots of programmes on it, hasn't there? Oh, I love this. <gasps> so peaceful. Mm. What a lovely cabochon. I really like that. It's put, put me in a nice, peaceful place. I have been doing a lot of yoga jewellery makers. You might notice I'm too calm for you lately. <laughs> you notice I'm calmer, Kim? You didn't. Oh, I'm, I'm in a yoga frame of mind these days, Kim. I started yoga mainly because I fancied Russell Brand, but now I really enjoy it for me. BTJ N29. £24.95 for a beautiful blue opal, October's birth gemstone. What a stunning colour. This is going to be gorgeous if you're into soutache. And I was saying actually to Sheila this morning, we don't do enough soutache. Why, where's the soutache gone in my life? Look at this. Oh! I love it together too. Oh, Kim, let's fly away. Let's go on a... Let's just get on a plane and go somewhere really hot and laugh. You know, just laugh. I don't care where we go. Let's just run across the sand and do like dancing in the playing our swimmers. Love it. Oh, life's too short. Debbie and Lou Joycey, what are the treatments on the Opal Cab? It's totes natural, Debbie. It was Debbie, wasn't it? Yes. It's totally natural, my angel from above. The only thing that's happened is that it has been um Angel from above, yeah. She's she's above. She's I'm worshipping her. I'm beneath her. That's what I mean. She's not floating on a cloud. She hasn't had her time in this world. And no, Kim, you always have to bring it down. Just leave me to what I'm doing. This is why I'm the presenter and you're the producer. All right. <laughs> I am your Mia monkey. You are the monkey grinder. I mean the organ grinder. Jury Maker does not recommend the aforementioned activity. Uh, BTJN29 is your item code. Now, Sheila, 
Yes. You look like you could do with a good old waff in love. Yes, I think it's time, isn't it? Yeah, it is time. Come on Best over waff. then. and they're just really active aren't they love them oh. I love an active lamb it makes me happy to see them frolicking I know when I drove this morning there was a big hill and all the sheep oh. and the lambs were all on the hill so what with the ducks and the sheep this morning yeah it was lovely we've got a flock we've got geese that go are they geese yeah they're geese, geese they're geese, geese. And, the, and lambs everywhere oh. love it number 19 oh, look wait, at the there sheep you go. there he is this is from Anna Lee who says hi everyone Firstly, congratulations to the special mum to be, Lucy. Lucy. Oh, was she? I didn't know that was a thing. She yeah. told you, did she? Yeah. You didn't. You didn't know for ages, and I was like, "So, any gossip?" And you were like, "No." I was like, "They don't know." Mm. <sighs> Thank God that's out. Cause I hate knowing <laughs> secrets. I know. I, know. <laughs> well, I looked at her though, and I knew. She? Like, I think I knew before she knew. I went. By the way, you're pregnant. She went. Shut up. And then rang me and went, oh my God, I think I am. Yeah. Uh, firstly, congratulations to Special Monthly Lucy. Love this. Do you know what it is? Do you know if it? I do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I do. Oh, you do too. Yes. We'll let her tell you. Uh, attached as a sheep. My daughter made me. Oh, oh I love so that. Lovely. Oh, bless her little darling I heart. I love that. I'd love she to make that. She made it from cloud clay. She's done a great job, and I love the little details. Oh, bless Don't her. let all the teenage horror stories put you off. I have a 16 year old son and a 12 year old daughter, and they have never given me a day's trouble. Just oh. love. And even now, I get hugs and cuddles. They spoil me and look after me. Oh, oh I love that. I, I do too. Mine are really good. I love them. Yeah. They um, take the Mickey out of me though. Yeah. They well, do. That's 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 not a bad. They don't take me seriously me at all. Uh, this is from a very lucky mum, and that's Annalee Hughes. Oh, oh Annalee. That's cool. You don't tell us what your daughter's called. I, I'm very nosy, Annalee. I need to know everything. You're number nineteen. I love that. I love it. I want one now. I want one. I want one. This Mia never makes me sheep. This is number 16. That's, I'll that's hold that good as her. well. Look, that's lovely. All <gasps> the different displays. How intricate are your work? Oh my gosh, with the three cabbages. Yes, and yes. And, and pong setting. And pong setting. Mm. This is number 16 and this is from Trish in South Wales. Oh. Um, Trish says, hi all. Um, I just had to send my Labradorite and Abelo necklace in. I have never put three cabochons together before. Thanks to Laura, I could see how you can achieve it. She's so clever, really good teacher. These have got to be the loveliest stones. They are magic. Um, of course, all from JM, you can't get the quality anywhere else. And the wire has got to be the best. The Abalon beads are lovely. Before JM started selling them, I had some from another source and paid, for, paid more for five beads rather than the strands, so that just proves, doesn't it? It does, yes. Had a beautiful strand of 14 from JM. The quality was far better. And thank you, JM, for all your help and ideas. Lots of love to you all. Please, please, can I have a win as my bank balance is getting desperate? Good luck to you all. And that's from Trish. There's a beautiful, well done. I love it. Gorgeous. Now, I'm going to show you a cabochon. So, so beautiful. The colours well. work yeah. very well. The precious metal against that deep blue. Mm. I love it. And very neat and tidy. Number 17 is from Gorgeous Brenda, who writes very short and sweet. Hi, Jewelry Maker. This is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. It's a purple magnesite like fasted slab uh, with one meter, a millimetre silver wire wrapped in 0 0.4. All from Jewelry Maker. Please, can we have more large bales of 0 0.25 and 0 0.4 as I'm in danger? Danger of running out. Uh, we'll try for you, my love. Do you know if there's any larger bales coming up? Not of hay, but of. Uh... <laughs> Not today. Not today. Not today. And this is number Tomorrow. 15. I love this. <gasps> very Gem Aquarius, darling. Isn't it very sexy, yes. lovely? Um, and this is from Trudy. And Trudy says, Hi, jewelry maker. Here is my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. A necklace made with copper wire and eyelight nuggets. Can I make a request? I would love to see the square half round wire you Me did too. in a bundle a while ago as it was copper and antique bronze. But I would love it in any colour. See what we can do. Thank you from Trudy. Oh, oh Trudy, Trudy. Gorgeous. That's good. I love that. I love that. Oh, 
Oh, I love pet colours. I love pegs anyway. Pegs. For some, it reminds me of primary school. Yeah. Number 18, I love this, and it's from Dawny in Coventry. And Dawn writes, good morning, everyone. Here is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. It's so much fun, Dawn. I love this. I was really inspired by the fork challenge. That's what it was, the fork challenge. Oh, dear. We found that this morning. I said, Kim, what is this? There's a plastic fork with Paula McKay. <laughs> um, on Wednesday morning, oh, I want to have a bit of fun. Uh, the necklaces and earrings are made with a tiny, with tiny wooden pegs from my stash. Sweet cord and fine is from Jewelry Maker. I had a lot of fun with this challenge, so I thought I'd share it with you. Hope you like it. I love it, and it is fun. It's colourful, it's bright, it's luscious. Uh, and it's from our gorgeous Dawn, who's wishing uh, all the fellow Waffers good luck as well. You're number 18. Thank good you luck so everybody. much. Good luck to everybody. Uh, the draw, of course, is on Wednesday. What day is it today? Friday. Is it Friday? It is Friday. It is Friday. It? Yeah. Friendly, friendly. You lose track of the days. You'd, oh, I lose Months. track of life. What's oh, going no. on? <laughs> Summer already. Now, we have got the Caramel Opal coming up for you after the break. Do not go anywhere. If you'd like to know how to get involved with us here at Jewelry Maker and get and join this crazy team, and maybe you want to also send your pieces into the Wall of Fame, here is just how you do it. The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewelry designer. Each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account and the runner-up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com or you can post your photos to Wall of Fame, The Genuine Gemstone Company, Unit 2D, Eagle Road, Moons Moat, Redditch, B989HF. Get making and good luck. Jewelry Maker have an extensive range of DVDs for all abilities. Each of our mediums has an introductory DVD to help you get started. If you're already an experienced jewelry maker, we have a collection of projects and more advanced DVDs to take your designs to the next level. We are always filming new DVDs with our specialist guest designers, so visit our website for more information. a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. Jewelry Maker offers an extensive range of creative workshops for all levels from beginners right through to advanced. Each workshop is run by our approachable tutors who are all friendly, knowledgeable and are specialists in their field of expertise. Our popular courses are tailor-made to suit your needs and to help you get started with a new hobby or to advance your skills onto the next level. We keep the class sizes small to ensure you get plenty of one-to-one -one attention, so book early to avoid disappointment. For more information, contact our call centre or visit our website. Have a look, because I think these colours are very tribal. I love these. Very different. Look at these swirls. Oh, I love caramel. I'm very partial to a Werther's original, are you? Look at that. You love it more? Do you know what I did yesterday? I've been, I ate three bags of, four bags of crisps. And then I put a double decker in the microwave and ate the lot. Have you ever eaten a melted double decker? No. Oh, it's the nicest thing ever. Is it? To give it a go, no. You could have been melting a twirl or a twix, yes. but you weren't. You were other brand, other things are available. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> These are lush. I would put this quite controversially, Claire. Is that beating your drum? <laughs> it feels like summer. It's dinging your bell, is it, Claire? Ding dong! 
hate it when posh men say that. I once was dancing with some guy and he went, ding dong, and that was it, I was away. I was like, sorry, no, not happening now. I was all up for giving you a snog before you said that. Now, <laughs> ding dong, don't ever say that to anyone, Mateo. Girls don't like it. You do like it, do you? I'm feeling this with blues, I am. But I'm thinking maybe some turquoise. What about some turquoise? What about some blue calcedony? Isn't that lovely? And actually you could do that in a ladder style weave, do you know, like a laddered bracelet. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see about greens. I'm not sure, we'll see. <gasps> oh my gosh, you know the what? That is really Roman goddess. And I've always wanted to be a Roman goddess, have you? You love it. I read Spartacus and I wanted to be a Roman goddess. Being bathed and all that lot. Now, it sounds good in the book, all right? <laughs> oh, anyway. Oh, Peel is a great, will you? D O J N 83 is your item code. Loads of you are in for this already. Aren't these gorgeous? I think we're going to have a real fun hour this hour. I think uh, I think it's Sammy the Wirebender Fletcher is coming up for you this afternoon. Look at that colour. What would you put these with, Sheila? Have you, have you had caramel opal yet? No, I haven't actually. No, I haven't. They are... Um, what would I put them with? Because I'm saying blues, but... What about ruby? Red, would it ruby. go with the ruby or, as well? Or an orange would look like a, like a coral or... What, yeah. like a bright orange? Oh, they, actually, they went lovely as well. I they like did that. look I was nice, didn't they? Yeah, those, those go lovely. I like that combination very I've much. I've also got some peach pearls. Some, yes. And I actually think that's quite nice as a bundle together. Yeah, it is actually, yeah. Very much so. A totally different look when you're but alternating the colours, isn't it? It is. That's why I always say always, you know, always mix things and see what they look like you know because you, you I'm always surprised at what they do look like I agree with mm. you yeah. and Linda always says that every yeah. color goes together and I'm like I don't think it does and she's like I'm telling you it does yeah it does. and Stevens of Staffordshire says hi I would put these with champagne but I just oh no that wasn't champagne they were, they were like um, a peachy color were they like a peach peachy color peach? yeah I yeah. agree I haven't got any I wish I did are they lovely even Thanks black conics and smoky quartz even those sort of you know the, the agreed yeah yeah that's what about that's this grey yeah. moonstone? Yeah. Oh no, that's that's a, such a gorgeous. It almost looks. It looks like there's sort of amber in it. You know what I mean? It's got that. It's got that colour in it, hasn't it? It's very chameleonific. Yeah, I've just chameleon made a word up. Yes. No, that's, that's chameleonific. Good. That's good. Chameleonesque. That's chameleonesque. Yes. But I can't say the word chameleon without thinking of boy George. No, I know. Oh, it annoys me. I know. <laughs> D-O-J and 83 is your item again. Esther's got two. A dream maker in Essex has got three. Loads of you multiply and it's only 27 pounds and 95 pence. Beautiful caramel opal. Love opals, do you? Liz B, you've got yours. Dream maker in Greater Manchester, you've got yours. A dream maker in Lincolnshire, Mary and Bucks, Andrea, Johan, Glenda, you've got yours. Bernadette, you've got yours. Carl, you've got yours. For nineteen pounds and ninety-five pence, you have got yourself. An incredible deal. That's why so many of you are multiplying today. Caramel Opal, it is Kim's pick of the day. What Kim made you go for this strand of your strand of the day, please? Not because it makes you hungry. Oh, because and it that does as well. Mm. That goes. Mm. It's lovely. It reminds Kim of Spain with all the terracottas. Mm. Mm. Oh, I haven't been to Spain. Oh, yeah, yeah, I have. I went the other week. <laughs> I was going to say in years. And what did you say? Your memory? Yeah, maybe. My, no, I just forgot that Marbella was in Spain. <laughs> <laughs> Normally we go to France, you see, don't we? I think we, we are all be so busy. We do, you know, we, our 
signals get a bit jumbled up, don't oh, they? Oh, my signals are all over the place. I've never got any network in my head. <laughs> no network. No network in Jenny Cleary's head. Uh, loads of you are... Oh, there is a queue on the phone lines. I need to let you know. Now, actually, the aquamarine I showed you earlier, very nice aquamarine. We've not had aquamarine this blue. I actually presumed it was chalcedony because it looked lovely. Do you know what this would be good with? The connectors. If you did three rows of it, and they would keep it neat. Kim, you and I have got to stop eating crisps. We've got to stop it, Kim. Doesn't matter. We shouldn't do it. Ali forgot her lunch. So did Kim. Uh, why have we not got a canteen? I think maybe I might start the canteen. Can you see me as a canteen lady? I'd be good. I've been a dinner lady before when I was about 17. I was the only dinner lady that wore heels. I was a, more a dinner girl, wasn't I, at like 17, at the boys' college in Cheltenham, which is the poshest school. And I'd be like, all right, love, what do you want? <laughs> actually, I was fine. I am actually posh. Now, look at these. They're gorgeous. Do you know that they call aquamarine the gemstone for lovers? It's said to bind a marriage and reignite the flames of love. This is your birth gemstone. You are a March baby, Sheila. I was, yeah. It's a gemstone that's so highly regarded that it's mainly it's paired with the likes of diamonds when you get it from a, a high-end jewellers. Aquamarine is said to also be the St. Christopher of gemstones. It is stunning. And look with that blue topaz. Oh and God. think about the rounds. Think about perhaps putting these in a weave. Think about putting these on the bead loom. Think about making a bead bead out of these. Making something very special out of these. Mixing it with another gemstone of a, a higher calibre. A pearl. A blue topaz, for instance. We've had some gorgeous things today. We really, really have. We have, haven't we? We really have. What about surrounding your cabochon? Exactly. Yes, the one. Yeah, the opal. Is it the opal one? Yeah. I think exactly. that's a gorgeous yeah. idea. Look at that. That would be beautiful, wouldn't it? Aquamarine. We'll just put it on some backing fabric that we sell that's on the website, yeah. Just sew it on. Gorgeous. Something I mean, not the cabochon, you stick that on, but then it does. It looks absolutely stunning. I would love to see this with some citrine. I'm, I'm a massive fan of citrine. Mm. I just love it. I think it would look beautiful together with citrine. I have got the most amazing pearls coming up for you. Just look at these two together. Oh, Isn't that yes. lovely? Yeah. Look how round those pearls are. Some rose quartz would go nice with that as well, wouldn't it? Tiny rose yeah, quartz. Yeah, because you've got the baby blues, mm, so the, yeah. those baby yeah. soft pinks Gorgeous. would be stunning as well. But what about... There goes in there. Look at this colour together. Mm. <gasps> See? So vintage bride. I love that. Get yourself on the phone lines for this one. You, you can't delay because we don't have loads. It is a brand new strand of aquamarine rounds. And remember the versatility that is behind a round. The fact that you can do so much. Think about your beaded kumihimo with these because a beaded kumihimo bracelet on precious metal would look incredible. We're looking at prices around £47 on our website for for aquamarine. Look at it next to the chalcedony. It's not chalcedony. Look at that. Oh, I love that. It's a mermaid's tail of colours. Do you know what? These, these are very ladro, these colours together. Do you remember the ladro craze in the 80s and 90s? Do you remember the ladro craze? The porcelain oh, ladro. Gosh, yes, I used to have Yes. Isn't it pretty? And yes. it's kind of ladro it, it is, it's, yeah, it is. Ladro Very blue. much so, it, yeah. Beautiful. Hello, Natalia. I was talking about you earlier. Oh, hi, Jenny. Hi. Love the show today. The aquamarine is stunning, and so are you. Um, from e um, Evan, Jade, Natalia, and Liam. Oh, it's a different Natalia. Oh, thank you so much, Evan, Jade, Natalia, and Liam. 
Have a lovely, 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 lovely day. Hang on a minute, Kim. No. 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 These should be... Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Perfect aquamarine rounds. Sheila, I'm going to bring you into this equation. Get back in your station. Yes, I am. I'm just clearing up my mess. All right, there don't worry go. about that. There we go. I'm back. Stop everything, Kim. Just get back in your brummy box. Aquamarine rounds. Perfect little rounds. I have seen go at a very high price tag for little rounds of sapphire, really high price tag. Mm -hmm. Not in comparison to the world, but in comparison to the rest of jewellery maker price tags, I've seen them go for about £60. I want you to guess the price tag of this, mm -hmm. because it is, it is not £60, but I want you to tell me how much you're prepared to pay. Uh, it, let's say it's the middle of the month. Mm -hmm. Don't have loads of money. But if I really, w which aquamarine is my gemstone, and I do, I do love it. And you, we don't, we get aquamarine nuggets, but we don't get rounds very often. No, um, rounds can so, be very expensive. Yeah. So I would, I mean, no, I don't know what Kim is going to do in there, but if I had to buy that somewhere else, I would probably think it would be something like 70 or 80 pounds 70 or 80 pounds yeah now I was thinking it was going to be quite a big price tag today because they're rounds like mm. this and because I remember giving mm. you a 70 pound stand of blue sapphires mm. because they were rounds mm. everyone went crazy for mm. them because they're that perfect round now these are your they something are blue for your wedding round. and traditionally aquamarine is the wedding gemstone so if I'm going to tell you that these are going under 40 pounds we're going to think right okay I'm going to think about investing yeah mm -hmm. When I tell you they're going under thirty pounds, you think right, I've got to have them. Oh yeah, and and as I said, as we said earlier on, and all during the show, that if you get a strand of such quality gemstones as that, for for any of you that do do your craft stores, wherever it may be, if you've got something like that on your store, whether it be earrings, whether it be as you said earlier on a single one in the middle of just some chain or some spaces, or it's the, it's the quality of the gemstone and the fact that it is what it is and the quality is that good then you will have so many on a strand at the price that we sell that you will triple your money probably and that's a that's a wonderful wonderful point you've got absolutely stacks i'm not counting them because there's loads loads on the strand they're four millimeter perfect rounds now these aren't just going under 30 pounds they're going under 15 pounds which is crazy. Now the price tag we're doing is stupid. Yeah, I'm actually going to tell you yes, that. Yes, it is stupid. It's because stupid. I thought myself, okay, can, I thought maybe twenty nine ninety five, something like that. She'll drop it to, but even that's that's. Well, you know it's going under stupid. fifteen pounds because I just told you. So you think <laughs> yes. under fifteen is stupid? I actually think Kim's gone mad, and I promise you, with my hand on my heart, cross my heart, hopes I stick ten needles in my eye, that I. I've not seen this price tag. I was not expecting it. I think if you're a clever jewellery maker now, you're going to buy a massive amount of these because I'm not going to promise you you're ever going to see this well, price that, tag well again. that's right, you see, and that's why you have to buy them when they are. Yeah, you have to because you won't... You, I mean, I can't remember the last time I've seen rounds in Aquamarine. Look at this insane price tag. They're $8.95. <laughs> Oh, wow. That's just truly, truly unbelievable. I mean, if those all don't go, then uh, in fact, I need... It should be like that supermarket situation yeah, it should, you said yeah. about earlier. I mean, what chance have I got of getting any now? I haven't, have I? I've got 50 unchecked baskets. I've, loads of these have gone already. They're only 8 95 If I'd have given you these at £60, I could have justified it. If I was giving you these at £30, I'd have told you you are getting super value. But at 8 95 that's just... Oh, what's the um, point in... I don't get what Kim's trying to do here. I don't know. Just do it. It's a mistake, maybe. I don't know. We shouldn't be giving you... Ac this is genuine acting. Is it heat treated what? Why is it so so low in price? And totally natural. And also, Jenny, if you look at the blue strand that's going through it, you can hardly see that blue strand. So that's that's the quality of the gemstone, isn't it? Lovely it's solid. saturation it's of colour. Yeah, yeah. This is this is insane. It's, it is a beautiful, beautiful. You can get the certification on this. Yeah. You can get the certificate to prove that it's been lab tested. 
and this is what it looked like, but obviously with the particulars. This has been lab tested as genuine, 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 genuine aquamarine. Grab it now. Uh, do you know what? You have to multi-buy on this one, I think. Because it, you, you can see strands like this for £60. Loads of you are doing that. Worcestershire, two for you. Suffolk, two for you. Uh, Joymaker in the Midlands, two for you. Margaret, two for you. Jane, um, two for you. Diane, two for you. Christine, two for you. Anne, two for you. Elizabeth, two for you. Marisa, uh, two for you. Diane, it's gone sold out. Well, that was mad. That was just unbelievable. That was. I, I'm well and truly shocked. We don't expect that behaviour from Kim, but we are very happy for you. We got a text from Sissy. Hello, Sissy. What a great surprise. Uh, what a great prize, sorry. Um, on one of our jewellery shows, that strand would have cost $29.95 in dollars, and it, would be, it wouldn't be that long. Uh, now you know why I buy from Jewelry Maker all the way from Oklahoma. We're getting so many US buyers. Uh, and, and I think that goes to show because in our brains, things are a better mm. price in America, aren't they? You go to America, you think, yes, I'm going to get loads of clothes. <sighs> wow, goodness gracious me. We've got a lovely tip for me, Sissy. Uh, a Jewelry Maker, Ophelia. What a Ooh, that's a good name. I never used to like aquamarine due to the greenish tint, but. Um, by some of them uh, but jewelry maker like this strand are some of the most beautiful powder blues I love them from Ophelia mm. we I love need, the name Ophelia more. yeah it's lovely isn't it really lovely Ophelia. yeah that was that was truly truly amazing truly made now we've got a chap doing the course uh, next door and I'm gonna say hello to one of his friends for him in a bit but I've just looked and he's not there He's obviously gone uh, for a shop, so I will bring him back to screen. Uh, one of his mates is watching him, uh, so I am going to put him on air for you in a bit. Now, Kim is going to give me another kit today. It's not a Sheila kit, it's a Bunning Beaders kit. I want to call it, let's get physical, physical. I want to get physical. That's a big old wrist, isn't it? Or is it cat's lead? collar might be a cat's collar my cat's mental at the moment she's having kittens as well have a look at this now this is the kit that you want if you are creating jewelry over the summer with the kids now you know I mention my little Mina Chan over and over again she is um, my little niece and she is obsessed with macrame and makumahimo and I had to learn how to do it so I could teach her and she loves it she can't get enough of it uh, now also my son who just turned 10 my little prince uh, he'll sit and make a, a macrame bracelet because Mark Smith taught him how to do it and he loved it he particularly loved the paracord you know it's something that the kids can do together it's something that boys can do without feeling it's girly making friendship bracelets because they'll wear them and believe me my son is a right boy I mean he plays football he's always out on his scooter he wouldn't do anything if he thought someone might think it was girly now unless the doors closed and then he's a, a right little baby now You've got all these wonderful colours in it, and the wax cord is really great. This wax cord because it keeps a nice knot, so it's super easy to use if you know for the kids. It also looks really wonderful with the gemstones that you can see here knotted. I don't know which budding bead has done this because there's no name. The no named budding beader. It isn't on the bracelet. No, let's have a little look for it. I think it's a cat, it could be a cat, it's a very large bracelet. Either that or they just loved doing it so much they didn't want to stop. Macrame bracelet. Isn't that fab? You're getting the findings. Loads of them! Now, who's this from? Just beautiful. The neon twist kit is just astonishing. I love, love, love it. Makes me feel sublime. Who's, um, who's done that? I want your name. I want your name. I'm that nosy. Are you nosy? I always want to know people's names. I sometimes guess people's names. Not that I'll ever know if I get it right or not. Guess that name. Okay. Sublime. They use the word sublime. No, not Julie. Daphne? Daphne. We'll never know, will we? We'll never know who sent that. 
Now look at the gemstones. I, I won that. Daphne's right. We'll never know who's the actual winner, but I'm saying it's me. Yeah, but now someone random's going to text in and say, oh, someone random texted in and say, I was Daphne. I was me, Daphne. You're saying it's Medulla. Look at that sparkle. So you've got the waxed cord. I love this kick. You've got everything you need. You've got the findings, you've got the cords, and you've got the gemstones. You're good to go as soon as you hit the ground, aren't you? As soon as this comes through your door, you can make. And I like that. ZIG C52 is your item code. Zari thread code at the bottom of your screen, which was a crazy price tag for three whole reels of it. Love this. I love these neon colours. Totally summery. You got the blue, you got the orange, you got the pink, and you got that neon yellow. I love this. You were looking in Prime Arnie the other day. The jewellery in there was all neon colour cords. I've bought jewellery from there before, but it's a once only wear. Like you can. I didn't say the actual name of the shop though, did I? You could go to the shop of top or um, the perk of Dorothy. You could go to want that trend. That's what I would do. Now, all yours, ZIG C52. The whole kit for under 20 pounds. You've got genuine black agate. It is black agate, right? Genuine black agate. You have got a gorgeous cord. Um, how, much, how much cord? 10 meters of each of the cord, and it's one millimeter thick. And you've got all these findings for under 20 pounds. What a great deal. Make sure you're grabbing this with both hands and running. Oh, yeah, 106 is the number to be calling. Well, you'd get, a, you'd get quite a few bracelets out of the cords. It depends if you want to mix the colors or not. Need about, each strand needs to be about a metre. What have you got 10 metres in there? You need three, three metres per, it's three metres per bracelet. Oh, oh, which bracelet would be one single strand, Claire? You're so right. And loads of bracelets. She's been here a while. She knows her stuff. Nineteen pounds and ninety-five pence. Eight hundred six double four six double five. Loads of you on the phone lines for this one. It is a great price tag. You can crochet record. You can kumahimo record. You can macrame with cord. And knit with cord. You can knit with it. You can knot cord. Knit and knot. Knit and knot. You can make a knot and then you can put a jump ring through it and dangle a gemstone from it. Oh, I like that idea. You can tassel with cord. You can tassel with it. You can use it for hair wraps. You can. And if you've got a big enough gemstone, then you can act a hole in the gemstone, then you can actually thread it through and, yeah. Oh, gosh, yes. You can use it with polymer clay. Yes. Make your own polymer clay mm -hmm. beads. You make rings out of it. Mm -hmm. Little macrame, macrame rings. You can. Bracelets. Well, as we've seen, bracelets we know. And, and necklaces. Definitely. And you can, you, there is also, if you knit with it, there's just four stitches that you put on and you knit every one and you, you go from one end of the needle to the other so you're pulling the pearl row, you're pulling it round the back of it to go in the knit row so you, all you do is knit just on the knit row and then pull it at the back of the pearl so it's easy, and it gives it? you it gives you like a kumahimo um, oh how lovely you know the same as kumahimo so you can use all of that for that yeah, I lovely. didn't, I'm going to be honest with you, I used to hate cord I love it now because yeah. I used to be frightened of things like the kumahimo and, and all of the numbers, but it's, I was stupid. It's my best thing now. Yeah, my just best getting thing. used Easy. to it, isn't it? It, yeah. it fires out really good results. I love it. Uh, an anonymous jewelry maker says these sparkle, the sparkle of those jewels are sublime. I love the show, big fan. Thank you so much for existing. Now we still don't know what your name is. So, same use of words, sublime. So it's got to be the same person. Mateo, guess on the name of the anonymous web texter. Janice. You're saying Jodie, are you? I've not seen a Jodie text in before. Jodies don't text. No. Jodies don't have phones. They do. Do you ever think that... I remember that thing I said to you that names taste of things. Biscuits. 
You taste the biscuits, Kim. I like mayonnaise, though, Claire. <laughs> Claire, mine was mayonnaise, which means I'll go with everything. I'm not sure that's a good quality. Now, let me update you. Do you ever think that, that names sound like things? It's not something I've thought about too much, actually. <laughs> yeah. I think it's like a condition. <laughs> it is a condition. Mateo tastes of blue tack. Other sticky things are available. Sticky things are available, such as white tack and sellotape. <laughs> Have a look. Coral taste of cocktails. Bill tastes like luncheon meat. No, <laughs> luncheon meat is not a good thing to taste of. It's like when your mum goes up to the deli counter and says, I'll have five slices of ox tongue. And you're like, no. Oh, no. Actually, my gran used to an do that. An ox tail. An ox tail. Yeah. Oh, no. No, I know. <laughs> oh, why would anyone want to eat that? I'd be like, oh, no, gran, please. And I know. When I was younger, I remember the neighbours cooking tripe and onions. It was like, mm. oh, stop. Ooh. I actually love the smell of liver and onions, but the oh, taste, I like the smell no. of that. Yeah. Smells great, tastes rank. Yeah. <laughs> You've got that gorgeous Valentine red. Now this, look closer, because at first glance, first glance, my prince and princesses, it looks navy or green, but it's not, it's both. It's peacock alula. It's lush, isn't it? be gorgeous that will when it's made up it really will it will mm. fleur taste of cauliflower cheese and then you've got that christmas combination mm. uh, do you know crafters we're crafting for christmas now they they make nice um macrame you know in the garden to put your pot in Make a macrame oh, pot. Oh, yes, that's what they used to do traditionally. That's mm, what macrame yeah, in the 70s yeah, is all about. It's like a yeah, big glass ball. Yeah. And you'd have like a spider plant coming Those out of it. Those would be fabulous they? to go in They the garden, would. Right? Wouldn't they? I say bring that trend back. Yes. Yes. NQRK14 is your item code. You've got 110 carats of Mystic Green and Mystic Green and... Mystic Green and Red and Red. Um, that confused me, that did. The... It's... Code of many colours that my mama made for me. That song makes me cry. Does that song make you cry? Code of many colours by Dolly Parton. Have a listen a bit. You oh, haven't well, listened to yeah. it. Haven't? I ha well, no, not really, not for the, a long time. Because the girls and boys were mean to her, and her mum had stitched it with love out of rags oh, so they didn't have any money, and then oh. everyone picked on her at school. I'll have to listen to that now. You have to, oh, it's great. NQR K14. You, know, you know so many things, Jenny. I've got a random font of knowledge <laughs> going on up here. You I only know that you have. For a while you because they leave have. me. Six pounds and ninety-five pence. I'm at hundred six triple four six double five six ninety-five. I mean, it's for nothing, isn't it? Six pence a meter. We got a lovely text from Louise in Warwickshire. You'd, uh, you'd need a lot of cord, but how fabulous would a 70s style macrame ha Yes! How that's much? what we were just, yes. yes! Only this was for plant pots, yeah. Hammock, gosh, that would take. I love time. hammocks. And I do. I love a hammock. I love an opportunity to lie in a hammock, more to the point. Absolutely. They don't come very often, do they? No. We need more relaxing times in our life, I've decided. At six pounds and 95 pence, brilliant value for you. 0800 644 655. It's so lovely to have you all on board here today. NQRK14 is your item code. Now, my dears and my darlings. Numero. When's um, Wimbledon starting, I wonder? Well, it's Queen's at the minute Queens, now, isn't it? Yeah. So it'll be with me next week or so. I love the sound of Wimbledon, do you? I love the sound of it. I want to go too, Claire. I'll come with you. I think go. I'd rather be one in because I have to keep doing this all the time. Yeah. When you're watching the tennis. Oh, yeah, you could just go. So if you go one in, then you can see it all, can't you? But if you... Oh, I think I'd have a neck ache. 
but I do love to watch it. Kim's telling me a joke. I heard the punchline though. You just. She says, "What time does Sean Connery go to Wimbledon?" Tennis. <laughs> Tennis. I like that. <laughs> oh, I must write that down. I must uh, write that down. <laughs> Oh, she is funny, that Kim, isn't she? You for, are those, funny, Kim. for those of us that remember 007 Do in the yeah. early days. Miss Money Partner. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, Miss Money The thing is, no matter what part he plays, he sounds exactly the same. I know, yeah. <laughs> like you. Now, look at these. Oh. I love them. Little pebbles of lushness. That's what these are. So you've got two strands of the little pebbles. And these long drops, long chips of labradoodle dye tea. And I actually think that one of these is going to be good enough to go in a pendant or quite a, quite a um, Lord of the Rings style ring. That spiky texture, a bit Game of Thrones. I haven't even watched one of them yet. Has anyone got series one I can borrow in a box set? Can I stream it online? I don't know if I'm capable. Claire needs a show to go. Oh, Claire, what airlines are you going with? Can I tell you what they did on mine? This is with Singapore again. Thus, from the very start, you start from The Hobbit and go all the way through to all the Lord of the Rings. But also the same with um, Mockingjay and all of that, what they're called, right from the beginning. And the same with Star Wars. So you can do that. And then I was there. Yeah, I loved it. But what you want to do is just have two whiskies and you'll be out. Where are you stopping, Claire? Oh, to buy how long for? How oh, lovely. Moonlight reflections on the Labradorite Trio. Look at that Labradorescence. Isn't it wonderful? I would definitely use this in a very textural piece because when the light flows around these, you're going to get a wonderful bounce back. And I think you're going to really enjoy it. MSG C34 is your item code 0800 Three strands of wonderful Labradorite going at an all time low. Now that's naughty. You naughty girl. This is why you need to buy bundles, Kim. You get all this different texture. You get absolutely loads of value for your money. You get a 30-day money-back guarantee. You get a bottomless basket. So you can put things into that basket all day long. We're only ever going to charge you once. An incredible value. 0800 644 655 MSG C34. Brilliant. Now, I'm going to give to you that gorgeous strand of moonstone. I think this is silver. I don't want to call it grey. This is a gemstone that's actually used in the film, in the in the making of the Lord of the Rings. Costume designer used this for the Elvish gemstone, moonstone. And I think it ha has got that sort of enchanted quality about it. Do you? I think it's enchanted. Just look. Isn't it fab? Don't forget to text us in. <gasps> Look at that. Moonstone gives you an iridescence that is totally natural and it's wonderful. I love it. It's going to go very well with those other cool colours. You want me to put it with the flower on? Sure, honey. I like that. Oh, I love that. It's like a storm. I love a storm. I love sunshine, but. We should have had a storm. We were going to have a storm, weren't we? And it just didn't happen. I do love a good thunderstorm. It's that <laughs> sound, isn't it? Hope it storms tonight. Is it going to? Will you look it up? Will you make it a storm? Do try and make it storm, Claire. Do. Laramar. Absolutely divine together with that. I took the wrong strand away like a nana, didn't I? 
Look at this. This is one of the birth gemstones of June as well, and they say it aids, some cultures believe that moonstone aids fertility. So that can be a good thing or a bad thing. Well, I'm not saying anything, but if you see how they fire them out here at Jewelry Maker Towers, left, right and centre. Yeah, Gems TV and Jewelry Makers, there's babies all afoot, isn't there? Look at this. Kim's gonna have one more Phil. Little baby Jenny. Can I be at least the middle J name? Am I? What if it's a boy? Jerry. <laughs> That's very Irish. Jerry Cleary. My name's Jerry Cleary. I told you my mum was going to call me Mariah, didn't I? Yeah, I would have been Mariah Cleary. How ridiculous would that have been? <laughs> they definitely got a paste into that school. Oh dear. <laughs> I love this. And in Rondell's as well, faceted. Should be 11, but Kim's very cheeky today. Should be 11 pounds and 95 pence, but Kim's not having it. Not for no one. Nine pounds and 95 pence. Under 10 pounds, just wonderful. And it's Friday, everyone, it's Friday. I love Friday. Oh, it's not a good day for Kim and the crew because that means that they're starting a, a weekend shift. Oh dear. I don't do weekends, me. You love it, you actually like, I like being here at the weekend. Sundays mm, is a good day here. Yeah, it is. I actually, I think if you went back on a normal, if you went back to Monday to Friday 9 to 5, you'd hate it. Couldn't do it now, could you? Eh? Now, we, so how have we still got some early bird chain left? There's no way. Not much. I did love that, did you? It's beautiful. So it's very it's, solid it's, as well. It is very, very solid. You wouldn't feel worried? No. Nothing. Because when you're working with delicate, with yourself, oh, I don't want to break it, because mm -hmm. it's so delicate, but this... It kind of feels unbreakable, but I'm not going to test that theory. Kim's reminded me of a time when I uh, thought something was strong and it wasn't <laughs> broke. I was like, oh, I thought that was strong. I looked like a right nana, didn't I? You have got that... It's, it's Versace. Gucci gold, it's Prada gold, I love it. That colour. Yeah. Do you know what, you, you get such a lovely luster coming from chain, don't you? It's a real, I don't know, it it's, it's looks so expensive and so classy, doesn't it? Definitely. It's a beautiful chain. And it please really be reminded is. as well, this isn't a copper chain. No. This is the bee's knees. This is sterling silver gold. with a nine carat gold overlay. Mm absolutely gorgeous isn't it gorgeous you can link onto that easily as well say that again my love you can link onto it easily you know if you want to do some chain link you could easily get you can. a feather light head pin through there one whole meter of chain was only 14 95 now i've got to tell you if everybody checks their baskets out then this is essentially sold out so please be quick don't hesitate on this one now I did say to you that we'd have a look at the chap next door, is there, but also I can see Potter is next door. You could watch Harry Potter from start to finish, Claire. Let's see, is the chap there next door? He's not there, but Fiona Potter. What's she doing in here? Is she up she? next? I thought it was Sammy. What are they up to in there? Hello! Potter. Potter, can you hear us? Can you hear us? Yes, she can can't you? hear us. No, she can't hear you, no. She's coming in coming in to say hello in she comes she must be on the di this afternoon she must be yeah it's our lovely fiona potter don't think she is coming in thought she was she's not now she sat me off yeah now which one do you want to do now kimberly hmm. Hmm. guess what happened the other day on the way to school uh, like five deer just walked across the road and they were like the little like oh. ones like Bambi with little fluffy tails. 
Oh, it must be the time of Wait, year I for us all to see all these. Um, oh, it's so lovely. Isn't it lovely, nature? It is. It is. Wonderful. Now, Julia Roberts has done this wonderful thing about nature on, um, if you look it up on YouTube, put mm. Julia Roberts' nature on there, Mother Nature. She talks about her perception of Mother Nature. Amazing. Really? How we should look after it. And Mother Nature doesn't care about us because Mother Nature will survive. Mother Nature is built to survive. Mm. And all, it's really interesting. Ooh. Just thought I'd let you know that. I'll, I'll check on that. So there's a lot for you to go away with today. There is today, I'll tell you what. <laughs> Black Spinel, I think this strand is more sparkly than a black diamond. A whole meter, and these are individually linked. That takes an age to do. Yes. No way I'm going to be doing that, let me tell you. OZU, D13 is your item code. These are gorgeous. They're just £14.95. 0800-644-655 is the number to be calling. Or the w's.jurymaker.com. Love this. I love it. Uh, now, this is a recap, so you are going to have to be quick if you want these because we don't have a massive amount left. Now, Philip, tell me, who is it Potter coming up this afternoon? And what's your, the theme of the show? Say it, say it again. Cabochon kits, road and night cabochon kits. Under £20. Kato clay, what's Kato clay? Brand new clay. What, what's the difference between polymer and Kato? Fiona will explain. I like Fiona Potter. I want her to look after me when I'm ill, if I'm ever ill. You know, she's that kind of, yeah. yeah. Right, that chap's next door now. We've got to give him some air time because his mates are watching. It's just his back. Let's see, he might turn out. There he is! Hey. Hey. <laughs> they're all in. They're all gossiping away in there. They don't know they're being filmed. No, they haven't we got to be TV saying on, anything. Have they? No. It's like the Big Brother house in there. I think I should go in the Big Brother house. Shall I go in? Oh yeah. Should I go in there? You'd sort them out, wouldn't you, Jenny? Yeah. I may, but people would hate you by the end of it. You've got to be careful about things like that, haven't you? Mm. you don't think I'd be hated? I do. No. Oh, let's recap those times night rounds. I can't, you can recap those now. Oh, okay. Oh, but I can re recap my round. I haven't got my round. Somebody, oh, I left it over by you, didn't I? It's there. Very right good. there. Coming there back go. in a minute. I put it there for you. Thank there you, love. You go. Hardy daddy. Coat of many colours that my mama made for me. I love it. I love this. Oh dear, Didn't, it won't sit right in my tweezers, I'm trying to get it to, I want to show you the, uh, the flow of colour through here, now you need, this is a checkout basket opportunity only, because these look like they are going to sell out, it's a round cabochon of tanzanite, it's absolutely stunning, flat on the bottom, domed on the top, and such a colour, what a colour. Look at that. I'm a big lover of that one. XLP06 is your item code. Use your debit card or your credit card if you're shopping with us here today at Jewelry Maker. Here was your crazy price tag at under £100 massively, under £50 in fact, at £49.95. You've got such a great value. Rings. Uh, lady bought two. She texted earlier to say she bought two because she was going to prong set these into earrings. I think that's a superb idea. Absolute craziness on the phone lines for this one. Uh, but we don't have many left. You are going to have to check your baskets. As so heads up to all those non-basket checkers. You need to check that basket out. You do. Now... It's time to go over to that lovely lady, our Sheila, with a quick reminder of our clearance bundle. Now, I thought these were really, really autumnal when I first mm. looked at them, but actually, they are so summery. And because of the trapezoid shape, they make even more well, shapes. They, yeah, they do. Yeah, you're absolutely right. They do. Yeah, they do. They go up, they go down, they go round. 
You can undulate with these. Yeah, you can love zigzag. It. You can, yeah, whatever. Lo and you've so, done yeah. that, look, yeah. alternated. I love it. I love that you've there. made that round there. That's very, don't very they tribal. So they sit so perfect, don't they? You couldn't sort of. But you've made them look really classy mm. by adding pearls. Adding pearls, or it's just a few pearls that I've got underneath. I get some pearls out, and yeah, so it, it it gives you a different look, doesn't it? It's quite an evening look, actually. I Holiday. love that. Yeah, going out for going a bit of tapas out. in the mm. evening. Yeah, with, your, with your long dress. Yeah, exactly. Maybe do a flamenco Keep dancing. Absolutely, you're she there, she. girl. I think we should all go on holiday together. How funny would that be? Oh, gosh, I'd lovely. love it. We'd be banned, wouldn't we? Ever get in there again? <laughs> it would be. We'd have the time of our lives, we would. Oh. And then you made some gorgeous earrings uh, using that fan technique, but actually just sticking to the gemstones on their own because, like, in their own right, they're giving such yeah. fabulous colour. Have a look at the earrings. They're, they're just great to play with, you know, to try and do different things. As you say, you know, they go up, they go down, they go round. They, yeah. And so you're putting them a chain using a design that you've used them um, actually. Uh, for some time but actually by using different gemstones change the look entirely. Oh, it definitely does yeah I always say that you know you you are dictated by the gemstones really. Absolutely and, and sometimes the colour but and the colours yeah. Look at these so you're getting the two strands for 8 95 well, you would if I didn't drop them <laughs> there we are. I did they catch fell them. off earlier and I had to put them back on I didn't quite put them on as good as they've been on the whiskey themselves yeah. as well. Yeah that's what it is yeah. Eight pounds and ninety-five pence. N E G C fifty-eight. I've discovered a, a new liking for whiskey. You have. I have. Whiskey is the drink of fun. Obviously, drink <laughs> you don't have too me. much. Just <laughs> one. I always wanted to be able to drink like drink whiskey because of like Dallas. Mm. They used to get stressed. Jr. would have a whiskey, whiskey wouldn't they? Yeah. Be like, yeah. oh, that's what rich people do. So I started doing it. Not in the daytime. I like it in a cup of tea. Oh, who doesn't? Yeah. Hi. I like a bit of brandy and tea too. Oh yes. Hi. And milk. There we go. Anyway. There we are. Other drinks are available, and please drink sensibly, uh, jewelry makers. NEGC58 is your item code. We've had such a fabulous day today. When are you back We've on? We've had lots Shield? of gorgeous things, haven't we today? We, have. we really have. Um, when am I on next Saturday? A week, week tomorrow. Week tomorrow, and what's the theme? I think Yet to be decided, just, eh? Yes. Yes. Yet to be decided. Yes. Classic elegance. That's yes. what I'm going to call it. Yes. I think it's special occasions or something like that. I can't. Yeah. So it's special. No, it's my challenge. It's not. It's my challenge. Oh, it's a Next challenge. Next Saturday, it's my challenge. Yeah. Okay. And we'll yeah. definitely stay in tune for that. Uh, now, Sheila it does is, have yeah. workshops, bridal workshops, um, wire work beginners workshops. Get yourself booked in. Now, the gorgeous Ali Defoy and the lovely Potter are yeah. coming up for you next. Do not miss those ladies. They are so much fun. Lots of love. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.